here. We should be booting up now. Sorry about running late. Uh, yep. Sorry about running late. I uh, was, I basically was um. Uh, the one the one podcast that I've been able to be a part of, they're signing me up for more stuff. And one of them was like, hey, we're doing one suddenly because of the, um, because of the whochamacallit, because the RE4 trailer that came out. Are you going to be able to make it? And I'm sitting there like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I have not seen it yet. I have not. I Wait, no, no, no. It's Cat that's talking about Atomic Hearts. Um, yeah, I've not seen it yet. So, um, that's at 5.30 my time, so I have to make sure to end the stream before then, which means if this is going to be the finale, we got a lot of bosses to kill. So, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, oh, down, up, down, down, up, um, why am I twitching like that? Okay, I think we're good. Um, no, I have not watched any of the trailers whatsoever. I'm, I'll be honest, I'm not really... Um, I saw, you know, just in my subscription feed, I saw that there was going to be, like, a, like, a Street Fighter 6. That's about it. Uh, I need to pull up a page. But, no, I'll be honest. I am, I am awful at, um, hold on. I am awful at keeping up with trailers and, like, yo, here's your upcoming game schedule for blah, blah, blah. I'm I'm awful at it. Okay, from the Dragon Temple Lift Grace. Okay, we have to find that shit. We need to do that before. I I wanted to make sure. Okay. Am I drifting? Hope oh, not. Nah, that's gonna be awkward. Um. Let's see, Ellen. Found and crumbling from the Dragon Temple Lift Grace. Can be accessed by using two stone sword keys. We gotta. I'm guessing it's that, but, um. We gotta. We gotta find that shit. It's either that or that. I'm 100% sure. But! That'll be our, that'll be our first goal. Let us begin. Hello everyone, my name is Max, also known as Electro. Welcome back to Elden Ring. On the last episode, I don't know why I paused there. On the last episode, what did we do? We cleared out this area completely. Got the one I got the one blood katana that everyone was really excited for, and then I proceeded to shit on it. And we made our way to the crumbling the crumbling Faramazula, where there is one major boss there, but before we do that, we need to find an old friend. So, no. What other what other Capcom games were there, by the way? But um, okay, hold on. But to do that, we need to Google Elden Ring. Okay, Crumbling Azula. How to get to Alexander? Because we need to be we need to be snappy about this. Okay. Um. Okay. Yeah, we, we, we have to be snappy. Um, where is it? Let's see. Hold on. Yep, I just confirmed on the map. It is right there. So I'm guessing it's right there. So I'm guessing we need to do this one of two ways. And my first instinct is to say there. Uh, past the courtyard, full skeleton enemies, the dragon temple lifts, which itself is beyond a stone sword key fog gate. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, useless ass polygon. That doesn't tell me shit. Alright, so that's gonna be our first goal. We're gonna do that, and then we'll take on, um, a beast clergyman. I forget his name, like Baruch or something like that. Alright, let's mark this, just so I can always... If we're going past a bunch of skeletons, we know we're going in the right direction. Oh no. I forgot to change my shit! I forgot to change my shit! I'm blocking up against a wall! This is not bode well! I can't believe I just sat there and tanked all that. Hold on. 
shit, this is a bad sign. Whoop. There, okay. Cat, hello. I was watching Obi Wan. I wish they released all episodes at once, but gotta wait three more weeks. So there's actually an interesting debate with that. Of yeah, cat, hello. There's actually an interesting debate with that. Of like, should a company release all the episodes at once, or um, or let it build up? Because on one side, right, you want to binge the whole thing because it's really good, but on the other side, it builds up anticipation. You know, it, it makes you excited for it because you have to wait. It gives people time to talk about it and discuss and da 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 da. Ooh, are you the skeletons? Hold on. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, my goodness. I'm doing awful. I'm doing dreadful. Yeah, this doesn't bode well at all. They should so much fun give it to the viewer to decide. Well, I mean, if you give it to the viewer to decide, isn't that just effectively leaving it all at once because then it's on you whether or not you want to watch it all at once or... Won't that effectively be the same thing? Shit. Because, yeah, I think there's definitely, like, you know, first instinct, everyone wants instant gratification, right? But the anticipation or something. Uh, we're talking about whether or not whether or not streaming services should release all episodes at once or let it be bi week or let it be like weekly or whatever. I'm personally of the mind I don't mind having to wait for episodes. I, I recognize not everyone's like that, but um I think part of that is because I know I have so many different things to watch. And we went past it. And we went past it. Is this it? Whoa! Shit! Off the cliff with you. We... Whoa, what? We went past... The fuck? How are we supposed to get in here? But, um... They split into two parts. Huh. Granted, okay, so I say all this, and I'll fully admit something about myself. I am awful. Like, absolutely, positively dreadful at keeping up with releases. I really am. Like, yeah, I know, I know we weren't specifically talking about the... The Capcom trailers, but consider that a symptom to the problem. I I just don't keep up with stuff. Like at all. Oh this might be it. Uh I don't know. Also just for the record. Oh 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 shit. Oh shit. Thank goodness I didn't jump on that thing and try it. Fuck yeah. I was gonna say, this is actually what we're looking for, so. I mean, that's why. No, that makes sense. That, that makes sense. You know, like, the point of streaming is you get to choose and whatnot. I'd buy that. But, I mean. I wouldn't. S mm, is it the purpose of it? I don't think so. Because, I mean, people still need time to, like, make shows and stuff, right? Uh, no, I hated it. No, th thank you. Thank you for that. I hated it. Like, oh, God. I really don't like thinking about early stuff I did. It, I, it was dreadful. It was cringy. I, I don't... Yeah, I know it's about... Shit. Yeah, I know it's all about personal growth and whatever, right? But, like, no. No. <laughs> Shit. Come on, back step, back step, back step. All right, we're good. Okay, I was going to say that I'll catch them both. Get out, 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 out. 
Yeah, you guys. You guys do a lot of moves that like open you up, which is great. There. I did that solely for flavor. Nice. Uh. So yeah, that that's actually my um. That's actually my parents' farmhouse. It was, um, obviously I don't live there now, but, um, yeah, in about seventh grade for me, so whatever year that was, they were like, you know what? It's always been a dream. Oop. It's always been a dream of ours. Let's go live on a farm. So yeah, they got, they got a farm property. We got, um, almost the cows and that's not true. We got uh, goats and chickens. At one point, we had geese and ducks until Mink killed one of them. But, um, yeah, and then my parents still live there. I, I visit there, not eh, oh, they're all gonna wake up. Not every week, but um, pretty often. Because, I mean, like, they live literally, it's literally like a 15 minute drive. Not even. Oops. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's a pretty cozy, nice little place. They don't do, um, they don't do goats and chickens anymore, but they're always talking about doing it again. There's a lot of skeletons here. Ah, shit. S, S, S. Hi. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Womp, womp. Womp, womp, womp. Wow, I actually got away with that shit. Hold on. There you go. Nope. Nope. Shit, they're covering for each other. Smarty pants. Good spear rush. And there we go. Oh, I think it was senior year of high school, and I I was doing it as like a hobby. And I'll admit, when I started, I was, you know, you see Markiplier. Great. So Elden Ring just starts crashing now. Lovely. But, um, oh, God, L looking back, there's so many different things I wanted to do, and all of it was copying other people, and then over time, I was like, oh, I'll do this, oh, I'll do that, oh, well, da, 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 da. yeah, it was senior year of high school, and I did it as a hobby, and then I joined the military, and I tried to keep it up, and I wanted to all sorts, you know, it, it I, I just don't like it, I don't think it really was until and then divorce happened. I think it was really until I started streaming where I really started to feel comfortable with the product that I was making. You know what I mean? And I tried all sorts of editing. Uh, now, the, the more I think about it, which I kind of puppy, uh, the more I think about it, the more embarrassed I get, to be completely honest. And I know, and I know there's a certain amount of like, me, you're embarrassed, but um, yeah, I'm definitely glad I don't do it that way anymore how's the military any stories uh tons if I could ever remember all of them so I joined the military I was in the Navi there you go I joined the Navy in 2014 I was originally gonna work as a is, is it is the game loud or is that just me yeah that's how I try to look at it. But, um, no, I joined the Navy in 2014, got out 2018. Uh, I originally was going to be, uh, I was originally going to be a nuclear whatever, except the recruiter was jacking me around the whole time. So I said, screw him, and I just did enlist, and I did IT stuff. Got to live in, um, the game is a little loud. Okay. Yeah, let's, uh, let's, ooh, ooh. I don't know why my controls are being. There we go. There we go. Sorry about that. But, um. 
Yeah, so I became an IT guy, and I lived in Japan in a basement. Well, that's not true. My job was in a basement, talking to submarines, and I did that until 2018, in which I got out for reasons that, in hindsight, I wish I didn't. But you know what? It worked out for the better. Oh, that's damage. Oh, uh, this is creepy. This is creepy. Oop. Oop. But, uh, stories. I don't really have any that I'm like, let me specifically tell you about blank. You know what I mean? Like, I've, I've always been really bad at that. Like, so my dad is a third generation Marine. I was going to be a Marine, but, um, just simply put, it was like, eh, maybe if I want to be an IT guy, they don't really use IT guys, so let's not. But, um, ooh, that guy's golden. Let's hope he doesn't explode. Nope. 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 <gasps> Do I still get golden lightning fortificate? Cool. But, um, my dad's always been better at storytelling than... Christy Gnome is emailing me, and I don't like it. But, um... What was I saying? Yeah, he's always been a lot better, like, just telling stories from the, you know, just out of nowhere. But that's because my dad's a superhero. He's been in, like, all sorts of... He's done all sorts of different jobs and been in all sorts of different places around the world. Should I kill this beautiful creature, or should I just... Kind of fucking them. Nah, I'm probably not gonna... Eh, maybe I can. Hold on. Wow, that did just about nothing. That did just about nothing. Okay, hold on. Wow, look how little damage we've actually done. Oh god, look how little damage we've actually done. Okay, and shum shum, shum shum shum. Ah! Shit. Okay, come on. Shum shum, shum shum shum. Perfect. We have Wombo Combo's tail. There you go. Oh, shit, that's a cliff. Can we talk about this? Ooh. Ah, come on. We'll say that this is this is making for a good warm up considering we got like a big ass scary boss to take care of in a little bit. Hey, bleed, 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 nope. Bleed, 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 bleed. Bleed. There you go. In short, pray for your head. <laughs> but, um, how did I like Japan? I miss it just about every day. I absolutely loved it. I think if, um,. If you were like, you know, point a finger, point a finger, what was your favorite aspect about Japan? It would probably be. Type, excuse me. It would probably be. Transportation. I never, I didn't own a car. I just used trains and stuff, trains and buses. But I adored just how interconnected everything was and how easily you could just hop on a train and, um, go wherever you wanted basically like everywhere was accessible by some kind of public transport and i love that and like there was such a high level of respect for it there was never a there oh ass there was never a moment of like 
I don't know. There, I, I remember when uh, I visited San Francisco, there's a few times we did public transport, like, down the streets, and I just felt completely unsafe. Kind of a, kind of a deal. But I never had that feeling in Japan. I always felt safe. I always felt, like, free to travel. I absolutely loved it. But, um, did I learn Japanese? I tried to, and I was dead awful. That's not even a joke. I, I was just genuinely... Oh, shit. I was really, really bad at it. And sure, there's a certain amount of, well, Max, you should apply yourself and try again. And I, I'll, I'll concede that. That's right, we're concede, yeah. yeah. I could agree with, oh shit, there he is. I could agree with that sentiment in general. I really should just sit down and try it again. But um, I only learned like basic ass pleasantries. <laughs> and uh, I don't even remember it very well now. I was just really bad. Oh shit, how'd you get over here? How'd you get over here, man? Sorry, sorry, hold on, hold on. There you go, okay. Friend ahead, friend ahead. Man, I can't talk straight. Hi, friend. Ah, I see you finally made it here yourself. Hello. City hanging in the air is slowly crumbling. What an incredible place we find. I'm turn my volume up a little bit. Does it sound better though? There's a single soul who could have handled that giant other than you. He's practically a god. You really helped during that fight. I count myself the great Alexander. Many. Which means I've but one thing to ask of you. Would you kindly undertake my ordeal? Come and tell me when you're ready. I've been longing to fight a warrior as a yep. competitor. Alright, good, good, good. But like you can hear, um. But you can like hear him like talk very well uh, talk well and everything god my my grip on the english language right now is awful but yeah he wants to challenge me i don't wanna i don't wanna he's such a bro <sighs> for you buddy i will you are ready then i take it then let us begin I bow to him. Let us become one champion together. Oh sorry, hang on, there's a cliff here. I almost soul calibered out. You, you, you understand how it is. Alright, buddy. For you, let's go. You actually don't have that much health. Oh, I'm an asshole. It was. It was. I implore you. Huh? Take what I bequeath from inside me. All vessels are destined to one day break. Mm. But the great Alexander lived as a warrior to his last. <laughs> oh, oh. Shard of Alexander and Alexander's innards. Okay, good, good, good. Um, we just killed. We just killed a good friend. Damn it! That's what he wanted. He wanted to go down fighting, and we gave that to him. But shit. All right. So as a result, there's a place we need to go to. <laughs> I feel like an asshole. Oh god. That really does, though, bring up an odd thing in this game that A, everything is becoming glass cannons, and B, PvP can end really quickly. Just straight up, it can end really, really, really quickly. Because Dolls of Dust, if he hit me, I would have been, like, destroyed. Oh. Like, just the fact that we, like, walked away and came back and, like, waited, outcome. waited for him to do his move. As a warrior, John. Hmm. Of glory. Yep. Wow. Cause are these yep. insights 
Yep. From Uncle Alexander. Yep. <sighs> Thank you, cuz mm. I'm a mm. warrior jar. So I need to be strong. I can mm. really have them. Right? Yep. I understand. Mm. I'll get strong. Strong enough. Mm. I deserve to have uncle's insights. Yeah. I don't think I'll see you mm. again. When I set out, warriors are supposed to work alone. Goodbye, mm. cuz. And thanks mm. for everything. I'll never forget you. I'll never forget you either. What was your I'll name again? What was your name again? Jarbjarn. <laughs> like, I'll never forget you either. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Alright, and then... He's gone. Uh, have I asked you a question about a rich man yet or no? Remind me. I did watch Atomic Hearts, by the way. But, um... Remind me. I'm going to replace this. This is special. <sighs> Shard of the Late Alexander, a shattered warrior jar. Greatly boosts the attack power of skills. Scraps of stewed flesh cling to the shard, and tattered or tatters of ornaments can be seen mingled within the slime. Relics of a red-haired champion, it would seem. Yeah. All right, so we want this shit because basically what it does is... I googled it. It makes all of your skills... It would make all of your it makes all your skills fifteen percent stronger, which I think against against uh Hooch call it against this next boss fight that we're going to be going into, I think is gonna be really helpful. Because that guy is really, really strong and this fight's gonna suck. So everyone mentally prep yourself for the rest of the stream. Alright, um, so your question. Okay, so if a rich man who offers you $50 million to stretch your colon, would you say yes? I'm going to assume this is not a proctology, or whatever the whatever the term is. I'm going to assume what that is. Uh, okay, here's a military story for you. There's a guy, his name's Sullivan, and if he ever sees this, I really hope he's doing well. He's a good guy. Kind of a bit of an oddball in a lot of ways. But a good guy. We recorded some stuff together that never saw the light of day. Um, someday we're gonna do a franchise series for Fatal Frame in honor of him. But um, that was one of the first. He was my sponsor. Like, he was my sponsor for the military. So basically, whenever you get to a new place, there's someone who is a sponsor, and their job is to. Where's my money? I remember we can block a lot of his shit, surprisingly. Like, he's fast and he's strong, but we can block a lot of his shit. Where the fuck is my money? Bitch, where my money? Bitch, where my money? I know it's in here. Bitch, where my money at? The one Moon Knight thing of like, where's my or my damn money, Dracula? No, seriously, where's my money? That was actually one of the first questions he asked, and he admitted later that he loved asking people that question because if they said no, he would start working them down or like working them up, kind of a thing of like, he he would basically start with, would you, would you let someone have sex with you, as in be a ooh, shit as in you know be a prostitute for a thousand dollars and then eventually he would figure out a price that someone would compromise their morals and he liked doing that he liked doing that because everyone's standards and morals would crumble at a certain point and eventually the answer I gave him and the one that I kind of just you know came to realize was there isn't an answer, or there shouldn't be. Because <laughs> no matter what, no matter what you answer, unless you say no, because if you say, like, no amount of money ever will, you're probably a liar. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought he was going to do a shockwave. You're probably a liar. 
And if you say, yeah, I'll do it for a million, then, or whatever, right? Then look at you who would compromise their morals, literally give up their of their own body for money. Sullivan sounds like he could definitely, he, like I said, he was an odd guy. I liked him a lot, but he, he, he definitely had a few screws loose. Yeah, if he ever sees this, I, I miss him and I hope he's doing well. Oh shit, look at the damage that just did. Oh, uh, I don't think that should have hit, but all right. And yeah, I know we're, we're taking this fight pretty damn slow. It's cause I'm trying to remember how this guy works. I'm getting the impression this might be a fight. Yeah, look how close we can actually get to him. Look how close we can actually get to him. But then he does shit like that, and that's where the problem kicks in. Come on. Nice. Damn it. Nice and slow. His second phase is gonna kick our ass, but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. We're not we're not worried about winning the first time. Nice and slow. Okay, I'm just gonna run. Run, let my stamina refill. That failed. I got that. Okay, this is gonna be bad. Uh, you are very good at telling stories about the battle. Of oh, like a historical fiction kind of a deal. That's awesome. We're gonna watch this cutscene in its fullness because I'm about to get my shit rocked. Where'd my money go? Like, Susie, where'd my money go? My money is in here somewhere. Oh no, because I fell off a cliff. I fell off a cliff, so it, it went away. Okay. I was gonna say, like, I know I have money in here. Oh God. Yeah, he's about to wreck our shit royally. Oh god. Oh, uh, here we go. Now, if I remember correctly, what we learned last time was this is one of those bosses that it's safer to go in than it is to go out. You know what I mean? The problem is though, we got some things we need to do. This is one of them. Watch for the shockwave. And I know I just said it's safer to go in and out, but we need to heal. Oh, I thought I'd catch him. Look at that, a dodge and a sweep. So good. Ah, okay, I was hoping I would get in more can't quite get away with blocking his shit anymore. And he's very good at getting out, which is a problem. But look at all this free real estate at his feet. Shit. Damn. Alright. We know where our money is. We know where our money is, so we can just run in, grab it, and then, um, I might, hmm, just for giggles purposes, I, I get the feeling he's resistant to sacred, so let's, let's switch to fire. Yeah, let's switch to fire. I think that'll help us. 
I don't know if he's weak to... I, I don't have any confirmation. We'll just have to kind of, like, generally look at the damage and see if we're doing more or less. But, yeah. Um, no, no, no. We, like, just, just got started and just conversation with Porter. And my brain just not functioning properly. So, no, 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 it's all good. It's all good. Uh, I started later than I want to because my internet stopped working. So, I had to do some real-life IT work. And then... I still don't even know what really caused it. Oh, yeah. Fire's, fire's doing much better. Oh, yeah. Fire is much, much stronger. Oh, this is bad. Doink. Damn it. But, um, yeah, my internet cut out, and then, yeah, the podcast. The podcast people are like, are you going to be on for today? And I'm like, uh, it's a little short notice, but if you need me. And they're like, yeah, we need you. I was like, uh, okay. Yeah, look at that big, oh, shit. That would have killed me. Get your butt over here. Alright, switch. Quickly do that before. Oh, that explodes. Okay, noted. Oh, God. Okay, every time he slams down, it goes in and then woof. So you gotta be ready with that second spin. Okay. <sighs> yep, yep. That was way faster than last time, though. So I feel pretty good about that. Yeah. It might have to be a, um, whatchamacallit, millennia situation where, like, I try to gauge where the middle point is to pop that. Yeah, I might have to do that. But in terms of like, nice. I think you mentioned that before, right? That, um, I forget. Did you say how well it's going though? Have you hit conversational or still like in the beginning of learning it? That's really nice. Nope. 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 You can't catch me. You can't catch me. This is a good amount of money. Okay, if he does that swing. Shit, he caught me. Actually, f fuck it. I'm gonna do it now. I would take a little bit of a risk here, but that's okay. But now, now I'm no longer taking that risk. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, drink up again. Shit. Shit. I deserve that. I deserve that. Might throw fireballs at him. Next time. There's a lot of questions. I'm sorry. Uh, what what was your what was your quest? Oh, the uh, 50 million. Uh, the best way to answer that question is just to not answer. I would like to think. I would hope, and I would like to think, that I would never be in such a situation where I would need to sell my body, in order to do it. Now, to a certain extent. I can definitely see myself in situations where I would take that. 50 million is very easily a life-changing amount of money. But doesn't mean I relish the idea of it. You know what I mean? Is there a part of me that would just say, fuck it, do it? 
Yeah, there is. 100%. But I don't like to give that part of my brain real estate. You know what I mean? So, my answer is not to answer because it speaks on the inherent lack of integrity all humans have. Shit, I just ate that. I just ate that too. I'm definitely not. Okay, let's go. That was bad. So you can block that move. Damn it. Shit. <sighs> Damn it. I am like okay. I'm not doing so hot against this guy. But right, exactly. Like, exactly. 50 million is 50 million. Like, you could, you could with ease live the rest of your life in luxury and then still have enough to give to your children and stuff. But, I don't know. I can't imagine, like, every time I buy something be like, I only have this money because some rich guy wanted to have a power play and I got, I got railed kind of a thing. I wouldn't feel good about that. Like, every time I spend money, be like... I, I know there's the other side of that coin, too, of being like, you know, hey, every time you spend money, sure, you feel some dishonor. What the fuck? Sure, you feel some dishonor because you know where and how you got it, but also... There's a certain amount of like, ha ha, he did that and I get to it. I get 50 million or ha ha. Oop. Or, you know, I made some noble sacrifice and yeah, I made some noble sacrifice and now me and my family get to live in what is effective, get to live in what is effectively luxury for the rest of our lives and our children's lives. So I gotta go back and forth with that. You throw yourself off the edge, big guy. Damn. Okay. Did it? He did it twice. He did it twice and just got away with it. There you go. Okay. Okay, come on. Shit. That's right, you can't block it. And I missed. I had, it, I had to drink potion. If I didn't drink, I would have died from the fire damage. Uh, okay. It would ruin the challenge of the last two bosses. Oh, I'm guessing they're, um, I'm guessing when you say that, they're kind of puzzle related. So if I know the puzzle, you can just kind of like bum rush and do it immediately. Is that, is that what you mean? But yeah, I'm pretty excited to start that game up again. I think that first intro sequence, or any sequence where there's just like a shit ton of those werewolves, I think that's going to be a little tricky. But um, the base gameplay itself, I think I'm going to do just fine. And especially now that we know things like, you know, the sacks of flour are really useful. There really are a lot of enemies you just simply don't have to fight. Um, there are a lot of enemies you simply don't have to fight. There's, uh, who do call it? Kill all the animals to get all the, to get all the food. Okay. 
I wasn't sure if that was going to make it through or not. Now, once again, look at all that damage we just did right there. This guy is definitely a glass cannon. Yeah, let me just do that. He's a glass cannon that really doesn't know what to do about pillars. And I missed. Oh, wow, I missed again. Just gonna, just gonna walk towards this. Nope. Just gonna politely. Yeah, a lot of his moves, if you just walk towards a pillar, you'll, oh. A lot of his moves, if you just walk towards a pillar, you're fine. I find that kind of hilarious. Oh, shit. I forgot about that. Yep, get out of the circle. Yeah, it's it's that and the multi slash that I'm worried about. Ah, oh, I missed time the roll. If we can't get this in a few more tries, I'll summon the the mimic, not the echo. Uh, and they should let's see. Thank you. Um, I just feel bad when you like say a bunch of stuff and I can't watch it because I'm like, <laughs> sorry, I'm, that I'm like, <laughs> but um, let's see. Uh, not just that, but they are also the last two villains, and they should be saved before the next one comes. Yeah. But uh, did I like the wolf spin? Of course, I adore every single Resident Evil game I play. Like, whenever it comes to the Magnum, I'm like, fuck yeah, let's go. I'm all about the Magnum. Forgot about that boost I had. It boosts my attack and my fire. And since we're using a fire sword, I think it's going to come in especially handy. Yeah, let him... Let him throw a fit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Just calmly walk towards him. Yep. Oh, now we back up and heal. Now we back up and heal. Yeah, look at this. He just can't. He just can't figure out what to do. Uh, that's true. That is true. Ah, missed. Bad timing. That was bad timing. I need to wait. See that shit right there? Uh, Cat thought he was gonna do the. Thought there was gonna be a big explosion. Okay, good, 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 good. Let. Let that block. Yep, yep, let it block. This. What? Ah! Oh! That is a secret to this guy, though. It's just walking up, doing the heavy. Or doing the drop over and over and over again. Wait, what? Oh, you cannot say I wasn't talking to you in a nice way without having other words thrown in after it. I wasn't talking to you. Hey, 
I'm sorry, I wasn't. Uh, hey, I'm sorry, I apologize. I wasn't talking to you. There, there you go. Or am I not allowed to say words before it either? I've done, I've done that before. Just been like, oh, hey, sorry, I apologize. I, I, I wasn't talking to you. Let him, I'm just letting him throw a fit. I'm just gonna keep walking towards you. Until moments like that. Let my stamina recharge. Then pop the spell. Just gonna keep walking towards you. Nope. I'm not even gonna let you do that spell. Am I getting? Sorry, hold on a second. Am I getting? Okay. So I thought I thought I was getting a bad email for a second. I, uh, what if I told you I was Sullivan? If you're Sullivan, I would tell you, I'm sorry that I haven't texted or emailed. I'm incredibly, I'm not a good conversationalist. I never really know what to talk about, but I wish you the best. And I'd love to hang out sometime. If you're not Sullivan, I'd say, fuck you for identity theft, muff. I will end you. <laughs> How dare you impersonate him? Uh, I'm sorry, do you see those rocks are still coming up? Oh, shit. Okay, watch for that long sweep. That long sweep was what got us last time, so stay frosty. Ugh! Damn it. He delayed that shit. Get your butt over here. It really is the same thing as before, though. It's just patience. This guy's all about patience. Watch for the backflip. And I missed. Drink, 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 drink. Worth it. Actually, one more and I'll mimic it because we have a lot more to go today. <sighs> Damn it. Yeah, that is what I would say. That, that, that is what I would say. I would welcome you with open arms if you were. And if you weren't, I'd hunt you down for identity theft. Uh... Okay. Like a descent into... Hey. Like a descent into madness. Yeah. I got away with some shit. Nanner, nanner. What are you going to do about it? I didn't think that was a spell. I thought that was him doing the slam down. He didn't snake nearly as much as I thought he would. Like right now. Yep, just walk away. Just walk away. Sup? Walk away, pump that spell. Boop. Ah. I thought that would... Thought that'd be it. Ah. Ooh. 
if that regeneration wasn't there, I would have died. Okay, one more and he's out. Okay. and careful. Shit. Shit. Drink, 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 drink. Drink, 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 drink. Shit. Shit, I'm in a healing loop if I ever was in... Fuck. I was so close. Literally two more drops. Wait, what? The whole five-hour story of slowly repairing the ship to get started again to go home and going in. Wait, hold on. Like, oh, so the story is you go, oh, you go. Okay, okay. Why am I turning? To just restart the ship herself, and after and after asking a bunch, she starts asking about past girlfriends you had and what it means to be human. Well, you can finally convince her to restart the ship herself and becomes your girlfriend and end the game in about 20 minutes. We're impressed that one person developer said in an interview that he did not know that was possible to add that into the game. He's probably being cheeky, but that's fun. I like that. I've always liked it in games when um, there's some cheeky way to just like beat the game. Like, okay, I've barely played Far Cry, but um, I forget which Far Cry it is, to be completely honest. But um, I know one of them, the quest basically start, or the game basically starts with you just wanting to like bury your mom's ashes or something like that. Something to that effect. And um, the whole game can be, like the main villain, he's one of the first characters you meet, and apparently he's just like, oh, I gotta go take care of something. Can you like wait here for a little bit? And you know, you're like, okay, sure, yeah. And that's when like the quest starts because you don't wait there. But if you do, you can just end the game really early. And he like helps you bury your mom's ashes or whatever it is, and that's it. I think that shit's hilarious. There we go. Nope, we're just gonna walk away. Play it safe. Okay, I didn't think that would reach me. And it did. Nope. Shit. Hang on, I'm gonna do this now. Because one more drop and he's gonna go down. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Uh, oh, of course, if he didn't add that, that'd be insanely creepy. That's why I say he was probably being cheeky. But it's fun. Nothing's wrong with a fun urban legend, right? Okay. Whew. Okay, now we need to... Perfect, perfect. Bad timing. Alright, uh, we're summoning the we're summoning the mimic. Uh, we're summoning the mimic. I know we're it's because we're under a little bit of a time constraint today. But uh yeah, we are we are summoning the mimic. Fuck it. Watch the mimic just get like murdered immediately too. Cause I have a sense of being patient. He doesn't. Well, <sighs> no, come on. Keep trying, Max. Keep trying. This guy's been your buddy the whole game. You've been feeding him death. He earned, like, he's deserved it. Fine. But I just want to kill him. I know. I don't know what it is. Something about this guy just annoys me. And I, I don't know what it is. I think it's because 
I know he has such little... He has... That's bad grammar. I think it's because I know he has so little health. And that, like, just simply hitting him like that takes so much of his health that when he does kill me, it bugs me. Because I'm sitting here like, I should just be able to overpower him. But that's kind of the point, right? It's a dance between two glass cannons. Not what I wanted. Oh, shit. There we go. Oh, that could be bad. Okay, good, good. They zooped me out of it. Uh, wait. Oh, no! Fuck. I was trying to get to that. That was really cool. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm annoyed. <laughs> Just straight up, I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed because I fucked up and forgot that I could just hold triangle instead of working through the menu. Yeah, yeah. You're 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 getting a you're getting Mimi. Congratulations. I hope I hope you like your consolation prize of getting slapped with a mimic. I'm not even sure the final bosses are. I know Jailwood knows, but um, I'd ask you to Google that for me, Cap. But I'm not sure. Spoiler. Yeah, no, no, don't worry about it. All right, congratulations. I'm annoyed. This is Mimi. You two are gonna play date. You get. You two are gonna go on a play date for a little bit. Fuck off, I just lost my money. Ah, that's really annoying. Would I recommend Elden Ring? Um, yeah, 100%. Yeah, would. 100%. Uh, if I had to rank this game among, like... Uh, nah, 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 don't, don't, don't. Well... It's hard for me to ask you to Google it. Because you don't know the game as well. Um, essentially, I was told there are three, there are four bosses left, including this one. And I'm just because I'm thinking time constraints and stuff. I Google it because I'll not remember. Fair point. All right, let's go, asshole. Um, look up Ashen Capital and how many bosses are in it. Elden Ring, Ashen Capital, bosses. I think we'll get you what you want. Yeah, I'm just gonna hold shield. And I missed. And I missed again. Thanks for tanking most of that. See, now, now I'm gonna beat him and it's gonna be like a cakewalk. And I'm gonna feel bad. Except I guess maybe I won't because this farm annoys me, so. You know what, no, I don't feel bad. Yeah, I don't feel bad, because Mimi's almost dead. And I'm almost dead. Nah, I'm not annoyed anymore. I'm a... Yep, there he goes. Yeah, I'm annoyed when it's the first phase. Or... Nah, fuck him. <laughs> 
when it's whatever, when it's Garank, I feel awful. I feel guilt. The moment it becomes Malekith, the moment his armor comes out. Wait a second, where's my puppy? The moment Malekith pops out, I'm just like, actually, no, fuck this guy. Honestly, like, hear me out. No, like, hear me out. I hate his guts. And I'm cool with this. Yeah, th this this time we got it. We, we, can, we can get him. I say that and I jinx myself. Because that's how this game tends to work. But yeah, to my knowledge, there should be three. Three. I don't know if there's any other optional ones. Oh no. Oh no. Drink, 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 drink. This is a really bad place. Because. This is a really bad place because there's two holes. Or, sorry, um, there's like two cliffs. Uh, 400. Yeah, it's not worth it. I would get further in life. Mimi! Get out of there, Mimi. There's a cliff. There's two. All right, I guess we're. Guess this is what we're doing. Teleport me out. Teleport me out. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Fuck. Yeah, I'm annoyed with you. I don't need Yep, there he is. A devastating blow. And there he dies. Yep, I I don't feel bad about Mimi. <sighs> I'll I'll drink all Oh shit. Yeah, like I saw on um I saw on Steam it said you had like already 70 hours into it. You are, you already took down the mimic tier and like the two gargoyles. So you've been going hard. I'm getting my ass kicked. But um I can't find an exact number. I'm very sorry, but I believe there are like 3 to 7 left. <laughs> oh, well, fuck it. How how are you liking it so far? All right, here's what we're going to do. We're just going to Bing da ding. Ah, oh, again. Okay, just gonna get the fuck out. And then. There. Nope, nope, gotta get out. Gotta wait. And then shkadunk. Shkadunk. Y'all hear that? That was my mimic who fell off a fucking cliff. Uh Yeah, I I think some patches and stuff came out. It's more addicting than crack. Fuck yeah, it is. It's Dark, it's dark Souls. But, um... There's my dog. Okay. Uh, who'd call it? Yeah, like... When we started playing Elden Ring initially, there's a lot of weird computer issues. Hopefully they patched it, but they may not have. So... You know, maybe, maybe it'll just work better for you if you... Come on. If you play it on console, maybe not. I don't know. Okay, I thought that was going to be the big slash. Boop. Oh my goodness. Okay, just... Shit. Okay, I'm going to heal just to be safe. Wow, that burning lasts a while. Okay, we're just gonna, I'm gonna play it real safe. Oh my goodness, I missed. I 
I missed by like a few inches and that would have killed him. This guy just pisses me off. <laughs> no, I, I don't know what it is. It's something about this guy gets me. Let's see. Uh, other than it running only on high settings. Hmm. I don't know if you can see. No, trust me. Uh, Humble Bundle. Humble Bundle is a drug. Don't, don't. Humble Bundle is a drug. If you ever just want to get a shit ton of games real cheap and also, and also, you know, donate towards a good cause, Humble Bundle. I haven't even played all of them. There's so many I haven't played. There's so many I've just put in a bin and said, like, I'll likely never play them. Oh, nope. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right, that little bit of floor. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, how about that? Yeah, we're doing... This guy annoys me. We're doing the bullshit method. I can't get over just how much damage each of those do. Nope. Let's see. Uh, let's see. How much you can get like five, ten gets ready to turn ever so often. Yeah. Yeah. And basically, for like Steam and stuff, they just give you a Steam code, and you just. You just, you know, plug it in and boom, games. I can't talk today, so I apologize. Alright, come on, let's go. I don't think he knows which one of us is the real one. That works. Oh. Oh my goodness, I keep missing. I think he's fully convinced that that's the real one. And that I'm the mimic. Oh my goodness! Stop! Stop! <laughs> Just... Fucking... St okay. I'm not the happiest camper with your ass. I finally got a hit in. I can't move. Okay, never mind. Shame. Come on, come on, come on. I just need you... Oh my goodness. Okay, take it slow. Take it. He's gonna backflip out. Fuck you. Take it slow. that guy. God, that was Remembrance of the Black Blade. Great, good shit. That was way harder than it should have been. God, I feel like an idiot. I should have been able just to go in and take care of that. Ugh. If I ever see it, it's gonna be fun watching my 40 and slip on VODs. Oh god, welcome to my life. I'm gonna touch the stick. Stage 3, let's go. Stage 3, let's go. Ah, we did it. Sorry, you did. <laughs> we did it. Just take my credit. We did it as a team. Poke the P. Poke the JPEG. Sauron, is that you? <laughs> oh no, I just did the bad ending. Ah shit! What have I done?
I don't even remember what I did. Why am I even doing this? I actually forgot. The room of death is unbound. I'm sorry. I think I just did the bad ending. And the lands between are shrouded by death's dark fate. I hope not. <laughs> uh. The flames will also burn the impenetrable thorns. Yeah. Oh, God. Farewell, it is then. You'll be Elden Lord yet. Okay, so basically, no matter what, the tree needed to start burning, alright? We're all on the same page there, and as a result, we fucked over the world. But now we can reinstate a new Elden Lord, which is us. It's gonna be me. You're burning the tree myself. <laughs> yeah, the the chaos ending is like once you once the three uh the way Jail explained it is once the three fingers hug you, once the three fingers hug you, that's it. You are stuck in that. The only way to get out of it is you have to do this like one specific side quest. Even if you do New Game Plus, it doesn't matter. You are stuck with that ending. Uh, my goal is to do the Randy ending. Oh no. Oh, no. Yeah, it's some weird specific. Yep, here we are. All right. Oh god, I wanna. I actually wanna teleport somewhere. I want. I wanna teleport to a few places just like out of gross curiosity. Okay, first let's level up. Yeah. I don't know if I'm over leveled, but uh. Oh well. Yeah. So. Now it's the Ashen Capital. You can see the uh, the depths are still there. The fingers are still there. But I just want to... This, this is for me and for funsies. There's someone we haven't talked to in a very long time. There he is. Max uh, level cap is 713. Yeah, but I don't know if it's like the recommended level or if I'm over it or not. Oh, God, seeing it like that is so scary. Why is that part glowing? Why is that part glowing? Oh, that is spooky. Oh, and there's like ashes in the wind now. Oh, I love it. Oh, I'm a bad person. I haven't talked to you in forever. Weren't you? Well, you're back. About Blyde. Uh, He's boorish, blunt, and couldn't find his nose with both hands. I think Tough. perhaps you don't need to see that no we have a say. Lament's not your butt. That is our call. Just the way we I think we already heard that from him. Okay, never mind. I thought you could talk to him more. Alright, the second place I wanted to go to out of curiosity is there. It was a sight to see for sure. Yeah, like this is Okay, so- Oh god, it's even more on fire! Yeah, what'd you think of that? What'd you think of that, two fingers? What do you think of these? What do you think of these two fingers? Oh, she's dead. Oh, she died. Okay, so... Malachus Blackblade. Uh, plunging into the summoning mirror to blades. Uh... Nice. Good ol's. Oh, it's a, it's a faith weapon, too. Alright, incantation. Black blade spinning slash that emits wave of light. What? Oh, I kind of want that, actually. But if I, t if I get it, I'll lose my, um... Actually, I kind of want that, but let's not. We've been... Oh, wait. Is this... Oh, it's his armor! Ah, uh, can I compare it? Okay, wait, hold on. I know how to compare it. I know how to compare it without buying it. Max, what are you doing? Okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Uh. Okay, so... 
this armor looks to be I mean it's heavier but I think it's better than my current armor in just about every way except for like holy damage oh wait hold on what if I switch in uh, the banished knight armor hold on what about now uh, it looks like, nah, my, uh, my Banished Knight armor is better in literally every way. Wow, it actually is. It is actually better in every single way, except for probably fashion and, um, probably fashion and, uh, weight. But it looks badass. Alright, Beast Helm made a black iron decorated with gold, worn by Malekith the Black Blade. Malekith, Queen America's loyal half-brother, bore a blade imbued with death and death, and there was not one demigod who did not fear him. Champions knew that knew what was at stake. Indeed, this that is what made them champions. Alright, we'll go back to wearing our We'll go back to wearing fashion souls, but um But yeah, I, I just wanted to Ooh. I just want to look at that real quick. Uh, where is shit? I lost it. Um, there it is. There's Millennia's. And then where's the Ronin? And then for charms, we need to put on the turtle. The turtle. Uh, where is Millicent's? We need to put on... Sorry, I realize you guys have said things in chat and I haven't looked at them because I'm trying to remember everything. Okay. Let's see. Uh, oh, she did. Uh, how do you dupe remembrances, by the way? I went to... Hello. I went to one of those walking mouse leases, but I think I'm missing something. Uh, you basically have to... Um, you have to bust into it and then there's the... the uh, there's like that grave with like the headless dude. You get it from you get it from that however there are a few that are a bit more picky like they only they only can do certain remembrances like the smaller the smaller time ones as opposed to like the big boy ones you know what i mean so you just have to look for those there you go oops <laughs> terrible yeah yeah there's some of them that are just plain picky there's some that some of them that are just plain picky for like zero good reasons, so you have to find another one. I kind of wish they marked it on the map which ones were which. Oh. I must be a blacksmith. Oh no. Now. Oh, he doesn't remember me. I'm gonna switch this back to sacred and double slash. He's burning too. Why does that girl weep for me? Oh. Have I forgotten something of dire importance? Damn it. Damn it. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Yep. All right, we got, to my knowledge, we have three. Oh, yep, that's right. You haven't played any of them. So that changes context. Okay, I'm going to say that is not what I meant to do. I'm going to look at you, and I'm still going to say yes, honestly. Um, so, my my fiancé, Megan, she hasn't played... She hasn't really played any Dark Souls games either. So... You know, she hasn't really played any Dark Souls games either, but when she played Elden Ring a little bit, she found that the game did a very good job of, like walking you through what it expects of you it was very fair there's tons of different fighting styles you could choose from i don't know why i'm running this direction by the way um and because this game is open world 
there definitely is a sense of, oh, this fight is kicking my ass. Let's leave. You know, you just mark it on the map and you just go somewhere else. You know what I mean? You, you just be like, okay, I can't beat this boss right now. I know I'll have to at some point, but not right now. And you can just leave. And it's just a nice, big, open world. I, I would still recommend it. My first instinct is to only recommend Dark Souls 1 to you first. But let's be honest, that game is kind of clunky and old. Is it still a good game? 100%. It's a very good game. Actually, it's been long enough. Hang on. I still got, you know, today's Friday, so I got a puppy with me. Hello. Drink some water. He's panting. Uh, let's actually take a quick fiver. We'll be right back. We'll be right back, everyone. Sorry about that. Had to go about fix a few dog things. But, um... Oh, uh, need to fix lighting, too. Arlo has been doing... Eh. Damn it, I am a freaking wreck today. Arlo has been doing a lot better. But we still have to worry about him chewing on wires and... Chewing on wires and other stuff. Peeing on the floor, so... <sighs> and my severe lack of lung capacity for some reason. So I still have to be, like, really careful. That's why I'm like, oh, he's up. Oh, okay. It's been two hours. <laughs> but, um... Jeez. Wait, is this the... Is this the sewers? Talisman ahead. Talisman. I don't know if this is the sewers or what. Q. 
keep moving. Yeah, this is... Oh. Subterranean shining grounds. Yeah, we've already been here. So this is fine. We just... Super right back up. But yeah, for um, first-time people playing any Souls-like game, would I recommend Elden Ring? Yeah! See, okay, so me, me and a friend of mine had discussed this before of, like, simply put, what's our favorite From Software game, right? Behold, the Erd Tree, it stands, tall and unwavering, mindless of the scorch of the flame, mindless. Ha 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 ha. Then we are yet golden ones. I don't know what kind of accent that th I think I'm going Scottish, but um, we were just casually chatting, just being like, "Yo, hey, what's our favorite Elden? Like, what's our favorite from software game kind of a deal?" And um, my friend, his name's Ethan. He said that uh, Dark Souls Three is probably his favorite, but he admits that that's probably because of a lot of things happened in his life during that time. He really got into it and. You know, when you just have that game that you play and it just helps you through something because you really enjoy it? that That's what it was for him. But mechanically, he was like, yeah, it's probably Elden Ring. And looking down the Dark Souls games, that's kind of what it feels like. Dark Souls 1, 2, 3 each are phenomenal. But the gameplay of it, of each game, is undeniable, honestly. You know... Two, mechanically, is just so much better than one. And three is better than two. And Elden Ring is better than all of them. And then Bloodborne and Sekiro are very much their own beasts. So you kind of have to look at them differently. I don't know where I'm going, by the way. Like, I just feel like there's so much open space. Like, there's got to be something. I mean, there's one thing over there. And there's one thing over here, so. Uh huh? Be wary of sorcery. What do you mean? There's nothing here. But, um... Yeah, for a first-timer, Elden Ring's totally fine. If you want it to be a little slower, maybe a little bit more clunky, I'd highly recommend Dark Souls 1. Because, you know, it, it's still a great game, and, you know, if you love Elden Ring and you go back to it, you'll probably love it. Sinner. betrayal ahead hello but yeah nice and here you'd come to stand what? before the elden ring to become elden what's Lord. that what a sad state of affairs i commend your spirit but alas none shall take the throne queen america has high hopes for us that we continue to struggle unto eternity Ooh, what did he just put on me? Ah, 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 ah! Shit! Oh! Damn it! I genuinely thought there was a platform there. I really did. I was my plan was to jump back and heal, because I was still kind of mentally distracted, just trying to analyze like what was that mark he put on me and everything. That was on accident. Now we're playing for keeps. I just wanted to hear your speed. He did it again. It seems to be some kind of global effect. Oh. Oh. Sh shit. He just cast it twice. He has access to a lot of weird spells, it would seem. He also keeps wanting to refill that. I don't know if you guys have seen. Yep. Yeah, this guy is just overwhelm tactics. That's all he is doing. He is just trying to overwhelm me. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's, that's not good. Bitch. I know that. I know that spell works. He is just trying to overwhelm me. And he can heal. He is literally just the dude. Alright. Alright, asshole. Wow, 
Bye. Hang on. <sighs> Alright, asshole. This is me trying to be nice and polite. No more being nice and polite. And yes, I think I'm, I, I know someone told me that, like, you know, you can take him down while he's saying his speech. You don't have to sit there and wait for him, but it felt right, so I was going to. <laughs> Jeez! That spell hits like a truck! Shit. Okay, I've lent that skull. Yeah, he is literally just throwing bullshit at me. Worth it. Just letting that explosion fly right on by. Nope. Yeah, now that I'm just walking up to his ass, he doesn't know what to do. Fuck you, how about that? Man cannot kill a god. Fuck you. Scepter of the all-knowing, all-knowing helm, all-knowing armor, all-knowing gauntlets. Kind of want to look that scepter at least. All right. Um. Uh. Is it not a... Is it not a... There it is. Scepter in the form of the hand grasping a pearl. Signature weapon of Sir Gideon Offnir, the all-knowing. The pearl stands for the world, the heavens, and an eye representing the many forms of knowledge, never fully attainable. Even knowing that, the all-knowing's uh, all knowing's hand grasps for it. Raise the scepter to manifest the realm of the all-knowing. Enemy, magic, and holy damage negation will be reduced for all within the area, including the caster. Ooh. And then, let's see. Helm set with countless eyes and ears. Yeah, his. I love that as a detail. It looks like a beard, but it's ears. Knowledge begins with the recognition of one's ignorance. The realization that the search for knowledge is unending. But when Gideon glimpsed into the will of Queen America, he shuddered in fear. At the end, that should not be. Yeah, makes sense. All right, I'm going to loop this up. This next direction is probably the direction we actually need to go, considering, you know, that. But there was another direction. There was another direction. So, yep, just check out Ava. Yeah, so we went to the right to get there. So I'm just going to real quick, real, real, real quick, see if there's another route in, see what we can figure out. And then, if we can, I think I know what the final boss looks like. I could be wrong. It's a dude dressed in black with a mace, right? That's all I know. But, um, that was kind of spoiled to me through osmosis. But, um, right before him, we need to be on the lookout for Brother Corin and Gold Mask, or Gold Face, whatever his name is. Hey, look, it's Brother Corin! He looks like he's having a bad day! Enchanted by a vain and ruinous delusion, he rejected the perfection of the Golden Order, seeking to supplant our glorious faith with his hope. Where is he right now? <laughs> Could there be a more pitiable comedy? Credit, the culmination of perfection. It's a nice tree, I don't know. Burning before our very eyes. <laughs> It's, it's all right. It's all right. Oh, I finally come. The master was nothing than chant seeking to look at it. 
I don't think he's doing all right. All right, so if that's the case then, right? Where's that madman now? I have no idea where he, where he maybe it's this off this way. I was kind of hoping I would see him standing there with a twitching finger in the distance, but maybe not. Try rump. What is anyway? Yeah, I don't know. Gold mask actually does have an ending. I think it has to do with finding I think it has to do with finding him but I don't know where he is or what he's doing or maybe maybe I just need to go rest that might be it honestly I'm, I might just need to um I might just need to go rest and then like check back where Corhin was and then maybe he'll do something or some shit. I don't know. I'm making it up, I admit it. Quests in these games very rarely ever make sense. Yeah, this is the elevator we went up. Or maybe, I don't know. No, 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 you're good, you're good, you're good. Okay, that looks like death. No, 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 you're all sorts of good. Hope you can forgive my ramblings. Okay. All right, yeah, we'll just, we'll, we'll we see where he is on the map. So we'll just rest and then go back. And if he's dead, because that's how all these fucking quests go. That's how all these fucking quests end up. That we just go and do a thing trying to help people and they end up dead bastards but otherwise we'll have to google where to find um gold mask cause that's not him right golden sunflower maybe it is alright uh oh oh I knew it. I knew it. Corhin's bell bearing, Corhin's robe, and a flail. <sighs> Damn it. Okay, let's Google real quick. Okay, so Elden Ring Gold Mask. Where do we. I should definitely send some pictures of my dog. I can send you some pictures right now. Um, okay, hold on. If you, okay, there it is. Give Mending Rune a perfect order in Lyndell Ashen Capital at the end. Uh, head south, southwest from the Lyndell Capital Ash, side of Grace, pass around on your left. If it's the south opposite, the giant Miranda's Rock. Golemask will be uphill if it's flying in front of them. Oh, well, shit. Okay, hang on. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, so. Okay. Pass the round stair. Okay. Uh, but yeah, hold on. There he is. That's Arlo. He's a little over four months. And he's cute as buttons. He's also way too smart for his own good. He's an incredibly intelligent little dog. Alright, um, so. Head south, 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 southwest. So if this is southwest, this is south, southwest. Wait, so we're in the right spot. <laughs> Damn it. All right. Head south, southwest from the, to pass the round staircase on your left and cross the tree log bridge. Oh, wow. So we really were in, in like just the right spot. But, uh, yeah, I will say, like, I, I know a lot of people when they look at like these Dark Souls games are like, they're getting easier. I like them better when they're difficult and you had to you had to slit your wrists and bang your head against your wall to accomplish anything. You know, like kind of a little bit elitist. But um I really enjoy Dark Souls because it's difficult. But I would say that Elden Ring is insanely accessible. 
it is incredibly accessible, and that's a good thing. How much can I pay you to hold Arlo for a couple of minutes? Um, Two dollars. Oh shit, it's awake. Oh shit, it's awake, it's awake, it's awake, it's awake, it's awake, it's awake. That's a joke. But um, I've tried holding Arlo on my lap for streams before. And he just, he does he just doesn't like sitting on my lap. Especially when I'm in this chair and I'm streaming, so. If I could, I would hold him in my lap all the time during stream and chill him out. But, um. He's, he's, he's going to sleep. I've, I don't want to, I don't want to disturb him. You know what I mean? I think, I think it got, if it got easier, then it's a difficulty would be whack. I think it's just right for people to enter the franchise with. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm going to say, if you give $2, I'm going to say no. Oh. Because he's, he's taking a nap. Or trying to, at least. Oh, God. He looks like a broken toy. Received mending rune. Mending rune of perfect order. There he is. In honor of you. And now we leave. Alright. Okay, let's look at this. Let's look at this item. Um, there it is. Rune discovered by the noble gold mask. Used to restore the fractured Elden Ring when brandished by the Elden Lord. A rune of transcendental ideology which will attempt to perfect the Golden Order. The current imperfection of the Golden Order or instability of ideology can be blamed upon the fickleness of the gods no better than men. That is that is the fly in the ointment. Right. So yeah, what we just did right there was we just unlocked Gold Mask's ending. Which is literally, you know, remake the Golden Order, but better. And I think it like maybe it gets rid of the gods or something, I don't know. But, um, yeah. A dog cam when his face is a sun. No. Um, dog cam if he ever gets good at, like, laying in one spot for an entire stream. So, you yeah, know, probably not. Uh, nope, can't do that. Yeah, so probably not ever as a result. But, you know, a girl can dream, right? All right, uh, we need about 41,000. We have a lot of souls, right? That's enough to level up. I don't really know what to level up now. Probably health. Yeah, we'll, we'll go back and forth between health and endurance. Let's see, uh, motion sensitive self turn, uh, turning dog cam when, what, it just tracks him? That'd be kind of creepy, honestly. Uh, that'll come when you give me the funding to do it. All in bits. Nah, just kidding, I have, to, I would have to get a, uh, like a, something so you could directly donate to me so you don't give Jeff Bezos any money, cause fuck yeah. Yeah, they have those. Creepy. For the record, I don't know where I'm going right now. Oops. He has returned. The Lord has returned at long last. Our very first Lord to brandish the Elder Ring once more. Oh shit, that's actually the way in. Oh god. Um, how do we get up there? Also, really, what is this accent? It's Scottish, right? I don't know why, but for some reason, I'm really nailing the Scottish accent, or at least I feel like I am. I don't really know for sure. But, like, it feels good in my heart. I honestly don't know. I, I don't know how to... I don't know for sure about that one. Here, let me just check something real quick. Yep, grants access to... Yep, 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 that's all it does. Uh... <laughs> damn it, cat! <laughs> Asking questions that destroy people's integrity. <laughs> oh, damn, wait, that's actually a good point. 
Well, okay, now, okay, now here's a question. Is he a gentle lover? <laughs> Damn it, that's actually a good... Frederick says, fuck yeah, I guess, all right. <laughs> Will he be a gentle lover? Does, is there consent? Like, is foreplay? Come on! <laughs> Yeah, you can't you can't ask Red Rose, that's cheating. It's like what what if a billionaire woman asked you to and he'd be like, I don't see what the problem is. <laughs> that's a terrible joke, sorry. Um Such is the course of my life. Okay, okay, okay. So this feels extreme Yeah, like I is he is he a gentle lover? Like is 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 it is it consensual, or is he just gonna like be horrible and rapey? Because in that case, fuck no. Look, if I'm if I'm gonna be hell, if I if I'm gonna be going through this, I want to be loved. Damn it! He's gonna buy me dinner. Uh, I thought it was innuendo. If he's gonna show down, she up there. <laughs> Chainsaw. Okay, so this feels extremely final bossy, so we're going to cheat just a little bit, okay? Just full disclosure, everyone, we're going to cheat a little bit. Okay, Elden Ring wiki boss list. Our goal here is not to look up the bosses. All right, Fextra Life, don't fail me now. Our goal is simply... What the fuck is this? A list of every boss's strength we can... That's actually cool, but... I don't want it. All right. Okay. Um, deal bosses greater. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Boss list by location. So we should just be able to go through and and read them, right? Uh. Eh, 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 eh. What? What's the? What's the blighted? Ah, eh, whatever. All right. Uh. Grave. Eh, 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 I don't think we can. Hold on. Uh. Eh, 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 okay. Uh, I think we did Electo. And uh, all right. This is incredibly scientific. What the fuck is that? Is uh, Mad Pumpkin has this the um Beastman of Faramazula? What? Uh, putrid avatar? What the fuck is a putrid avatar? Oh, we've killed a ton of those things. Alright, uh, okay. Uh, Elmer the Briar? Uh, Necromancer Garrus? Uh, 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 Omen Killer Perfume? Uh, good enough. Uh, probably fine. Is uh, the Onyx Lord? Uh, yeah, 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 we definitely did all those. Wait, hold on. Esgar fell twins. Okay, hold on. Alright, um... Okay. Yeah, we did that. Um... Uh, Alright. Um... We did that one. Yeah. Okay. Let's try it. Okay, hold on. Okay, there. Let's see. Uh, if you eat six dead spiders, what kind of spiders are they? Uh, that guy is. This guy's immortal. We can't beat him, so give up hope. All right. I don't know who that is, but I think we beat him. Pretty sure we beat this guy. Pretty sure. Yeah, we beat him. Decane, yep, we beat him. Uh, Bisa, yep, 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 we beat him. Pretty sure we beat him. Elamar the Briar, we beat him. I don't know who this guy is. I think we beat him. Onyx Lord, yeah, we beat him. Fell Twins, yep, we did him. Esker Priest of Blood. Yeah, yeah, yeah we got we beat him. Godfrey, first Elden Lord. Uh Um Hmm. 
No, no, we beat this guy. We beat this guy. Okay. Uh, yep, we beat him. Yep, we beat him. Yep, we beat him. Uh, Radagon of the... This boss is not optional, so I'm just going to stand a reason. Uh, the Elden Throne. Okay. What the fuck is this thing? Uh, this is going to upon defeating Radagon. Okay, great. All right, in that case, I think we're good. <laughs> Uh oh, if they're daddy long legs or something, fuck yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, exactly. Daddy long legs, fuck yeah. Yeah, doesn't say anything about like not just going and then eating them. So, <laughs> um, I think in all honesty, though. Someone out there is. I'm already looking at the house. I'm going to buy get your checkbook out. <laughs> Alright. Someone out there is probably going to tell me that there is some boss, you know, oh, you didn't do the uh, Volcano Manor. Oh, you didn't do the whatever. You, you know, because you helped Millicent, you didn't fight her because, you know, all that shit, right? I think we're good to go. I think we're genuinely good to go. The question is, is this the equipment that we're happy with? I think it is. I think it is the equipment we're happy with. Let's do it. Oh, uh, did I try using the Fat Boys equipment? Oh, that's true. We should do some Fashion Souls. We should do some Fashion Souls. Um, I recognize this armor is, like, technically better than my armor. But I... It's like, it's like wearing this armor, right? I... Look. Look, I... I okay. Okay, hold on. You blow it and can only crush them up with their, with their tongue. I think I can suffer through that. All right, like, oh, the shroom, the, shroom, the shroom armor. Hold on, the. Uh... I mean, if you're doing a poison build, like, I, I'm, I'm willing to, I'm willing to work with this. But uh, yeah, okay. So our stats, the actually doesn't look bad. The stat, our stats, the most important factor. Yes, but there's got to be a certain amount of self-respect. I mean, I, I, nah, 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 I can't do it. This armor, see, I can respect myself in. I can respect myself in this, and I look pretty damn nice. All right, so here's the question. Here's the question, everyone. Do we go in like this? This is our fashion souls set. Or do we... Actually, sorry, hold on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to Queen's bed chair. I'm going to do something really stupid. Do we go in with our Fashion Souls set? Or do we go in with, um, rest in peace, I'm wearing the full set. <laughs> Look, if you do, God bless you. I hope it makes you happy. I, I just can't respect myself wearing it. Although I will say... <gasps> there's someone else I should talk to, too. I will say, though... The hat looks pretty funny. Not gonna, not gonna lie, the hat, the hat makes me giggle. But um, yeah, should we should we wear fashion souls or should we go in with um? Now let's do fashion souls, because if I was gonna go in with like the armor that actually makes sense, I would wear. I would wear the uh, banished. Oops, I would I would wear the. Uh, the banished knight it's just simply the best i still have medium load it looks pretty nice but if we're talking if we're talking fashion oops i want that ronin armor i want millennia's gauntlet oh should we wear the the pants nah 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 we gotta. Oh nope, that's not it. Uh, we gotta wear that. 
Ronin. Let's see. Where the biggest hat in your inventory? Gotta go fashion, go all out. See, I, I like this look. It's nice, you know, nothing, like a good bucket helmet, you know what I mean? I know it's very paladin of me, but we've been doing a paladin dexterity build, and I also really like how, ugh, I really like how a lot of our armor, it's memories of people. You know what I mean? It's memories. It's, well, okay, we don't, not everything is a memory, but like, you know, we have the dragons, we have our friend Yura, which is why we're in the Ronin set, we have millennia we have millicent we have alexander we have the dragons we have the dragons but like it's it's like we're bringing a part of them with us and i know i'm not doing that for every character but that's what it feels like to me you know it's like we're bringing them with we're honoring them yeah she's she's fucking dead so this is the end anyway right so fuck it let's buy some gear We'll buy as much as we can if we don't have enough to get all of it. I'll just, maybe I'll sell some stuff or I'll just look at them and say, fuck it. Like, we're, we're, we're literally about to go take on the final boss. Money is irrelevant. Who cares? Let's buy some cool shit. Uh, do old people have a smell? I think so. Might just be the brand of soap they use in nursing homes. Uh, uh <laughs> what a great lore question. <laughs> Max, do you know the answer? Uh, Wait, what? Oh, Brom by Renala. Uh, who, who else is? See, I could wear the veteran's armor, which is basically, like, upgraded. Oh, that's exactly what it is. It's basically upgraded Banished Knight. But I don't like the helmet. That looks nice. But, um, Lord of Blood's robe. Uh, do old people have a smell? Probably. And did they break the... Alright, so I'm not perfect on the lore. I want that stated for the record before I say anything and everyone tells me I'm wrong, okay? I want I want that stated. I'm not perfect on the lore. Holy shit. Hot damn. Hot damn. Look at that. That shit looks sinister as fuck. Oh, I kind of like it. Uh, I kind of like it. Yeah, that shit looks sinister. That is some that is some final boss armor right there. And it does have better stats. No, it actually doesn't. It has worse stats. Never mind. I was going to say, like, it does have better stats than my current stuff. It's like, really? Actually, no, it doesn't. It's better the helmet isn't as good. But, um... Well, where's Millennia's? Yeah, Millennia's is worse. Oh, wait, this is my reed armor. Nah, clashes. Nah, 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 nah. We, we need that Ronin. It still clashes. Uh, Let's get rid of that. Put on the Ronin. It just feels right. You know what I mean? It just feels right. Let's see. Uh... Right. I, I I get that. I think what would really help me, like kind of along that same thought process, is um just put check marks. Like all these different caves and things. Just put a check mark if you've like been to it and beat the boss, you know what I mean? Like that would help me a lot. So that way you could like go through and be like check 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 check. <gasps> I wanna go talk to them. I wanna go talk to them. These guys are people. These are people that I have helped that didn't die in the process. Oh god, they haven't died. Uh. Nefeli. I will remain to set your guide on Shawnee by us. Wow, you're not. Okay, great. You, you've said literally nothing different. All right, cool. Uh, the entire God is burning alive right now, but all right, fuck it. Here we go. <laughs> kind of wish you'd say different things or something. 
But, um... Okay, so... Uh, how... Oh, God. Alright, Max. Mr. Smart... Uh, fuck it. I got money to blow. I'm gonna blow it. Alright, Max. What's the story of Elden Ring? Uh... Assassins... The, the, the Elden Ring was smashed and um, uh, as a result people who would normally die and go to the tree stopped doing that so now the Tarnished are coming up to get a new Elden Lord because the previous Elden Lord was assassinated and everyone started going nuts and like, there's a Scarlet Rot that's like corrupting the world and there's a bunch of people all trying to do shit to fix it. <laughs> I don't know the story at all, and I am so, so sorry. I really don't know the story. <laughs> it was a reverse Lord of the Rings there. The one ring was broken, split between everyone versus cause insanity control the people the rings he made were given to. Uh, yeah! Yeah! Max, do you even know what you're buying? No! Yeah! No! Maybe... No... Yeah? Alright, I'm not gonna buy either of these cokes, cause... Cause fuck em. Bought everyone else's shit except for... Except for the fellow men and the Lord of Blood, cause fuck em. Now I do want to compare, though. Like, okay, hold on. Yep, it is. Okay, so. Fashion Souls. Oh, wow. Look at that. That is hideous as shit. Hold on. I hate it. Oh, I hate it. It's too big. It's too big, but I think, technically speaking... I think, technically speaking... Yeah, technically speaking, this is my best armor. But it's so big. Look at that. Oh, God, I should have it tailored. Oh, wait, the guy who tailors my shit fucking died. Altar garments. Um, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Alright, this, a lot more reasonable. But even then, that's not the point. It's not the point. The point of it is that it's... Oops. The point of it is that it's big and gigantic. And... Anyway, sorry. I'm, I'm procrastinating because I'm really excited to... I'm excited. But it's the end. It's gonna be the end. And that makes me really sad. We're gonna fashion souls this shit. Okay, and then let's go to here. At the end. Gotta need unsheath. Let's do this shit. Oh, might as well. I don't know, we only got seven of these bitches, but we might we might as well. Let's do this shit. Let's see, uh... I'm, but that's the gist of what I got, which is why I'm burning everything to the ground as a little chaos next playthrough. I'll be nice. <laughs> Say, fuck it, restart. But, um... The end is never the end, though. Eh, with Elden Ring? Maybe. I feel like we've spent way too long in this series, though, but... Maybe. But, uh, okay, so... I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now, it's Bach, okay? When Bach says... I hear about the lady that can make me reborn, but I need a larval tear, and where will I get one? Do not give him one. Don't do it. Because that's what I did. I did it because I was like, oh, you want to be reborn? Well, it's up to you, man. Here you go. And I forgot that being reborn wasn't perfect. And that it kills people. So he died. And I felt like an asshole. Instead, you're going to get, um, if you explore, I don't remember where it is. You, you might have to Google it. Um, there's a thing right here. This is Prattling Plate. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. Play that in front of him instead. Play that in front of him. 
Because he asked for it, so I gave it to him. He asked for it, so I gave it to him. And I was just like, yeah, sure, man. I got, like, literally... How many of these fucking things do I got? I had, like, 12. So I was like, yeah, sure, have one. And he died. So, rip. So just as a general note. Just as a general note. Don't give it to him. But anyways. <sighs> Let's do this. Oh, God. He turned he turned like a little naked dude with a hat on, then then like when I rested, he just flopped over and died. It was really sad. Yeah. He he couldn't say a word word, it's like his mouth was fused shut. It's been a long while, Morgoth. My name is not Morgoth. Oh, oh, oh. This guy has a fucking stand. Holy shit. This guy has a stand. Long and hard didst thou fight, tarnished warrior. Thank you. Spurned by the grace of gold. Oh my goodness, he has a stand. Be assured the Elden Ring resteth close at hand. Sorry. I've been I've been told by per, like multiple people I need to though. So if for one of our um for if, if one of our viewer choice streams someone wants it to be Kingdom Hearts 1, I will heavily consider it. To be granted audience once more. Hey puppy. <sighs> First Elden Lord. <laughs> Let's fucking go. No flip. Good. Ooh. Holy shit. Okay. It's the same strategy a lot of the Crucible Knights use. Of doing that stomp and then setting up an attack. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm setting up an attack and then. That's literally all he's doing. He's doing setup and swing. Alright. Let's see what you think of dragons. Okay, not bad. Let's see what you think of fire. Oh shit! Right, give it to you, big guy. Okay, that couldn't be blocked. Noted. Shit. G oh, God. That shockwave is rough. Holy shit. Stop. <laughs> Stop it. Oh, that was a bad idea. One more. Stop that shit. Ah, okay. Didn't. Fuck. 
All right, I'm gonna throw out a guess. I need to flip on fire instead of instead of sacred. But okay, yeah, you had a good rhythm. You had a good rhythm. Oh shit! Proud or critical if you can. Uh, this phase should be easy. So you fought his shadow in the capital. That's right. I didn't think of that as that, but that's definitely what that is. A devastating blow. Let's do this shit. Yeah, he didn't seem to. I bet. I bet if I switch to fire, it's gonna do a lot more damage. And just judging by that one boss, the Elden Beast or whatever being golden, I'm guessing it's just gonna be like pure sacred. So we're not worried about our money. We already spent it all. So let's do this. I'm gonna boost up because I can. What are you gonna do about it? What's up? Bad timing. Oh yeah, look at all that more damage. And it missed. Shit. Okay, come on. That's me getting greedy. And I deserve that. button I wanted to do this let's go big guy good good all right come on gotta nail that timing Ooh, that was very lucky oh here we go here we go I'll use my stand star platinum I had higher graphics now because that shadow probably would have been a lot more, you know, not as pixeled. Holy shit, he just killed his pet. Oh, golly, this is. Oh, fuck. I've given thee courtesy enough. I fire one arrow into like it just hits his shoulder barely and he's just like what the fuck man <laughs> now I fight just horror Warrior! I'm dating your daughter I just want you to know that oh shit he's a grappler build <laughs> fuck Ow, okay. Oh my goodness. He's a grappler build now. And he's got delay. It's. I thought he was gonna impale me right there. Holy shit, I love it. Fire's still doing real well though. Oh, he's. Oh! Horalu for Street Fighter. 
Poralu for Street Fighter. Let's go. Oh, he's got... Oh, good to know I can block it, though. Delay. It's a delayed... Jeez! Holy shit. Let's go. Damn. Uh, did he just get taller? Yep, just like before. Oh, there's two. Damn. I love it. Oh, I love it. What's the thing in One Piece? Da dora da dora. <laughs> Wait, hold on. What's it? Da hora da hora. The song? I'm not entirely sure. But um, what's the thing in One Piece where it's like, is it first gear or like when Luffy like pumps his blood faster, kind of a thing? That's what that reminds me of. Let's go. That was awesome. Can't believe you had to kill your pet to pop that off, but you know what? I love it. Let's go. Uh, Badass. Oh. Boop, boop. Greedy. Look how far down we got. We only, we only had to heal once so far. I need to quit relying on um, unsheathed so much, but it's just so hard to argue with the damage it pumps out. And I can do shit like that. And it's not like he moves very much. Let's see. Oh, Dexter's lab. He said the honor. The he said the horror sound like da hora. Is it stretched by a love that shows enough? Okay, we need to get this one. I'm not sure. I keep forgetting he's got two during that. That would have been death. Shit! Combos! Shit, the combos. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And he's smart enough to know not to do it when he's missing. Oh, he's got axe kicks. Oh, shit, he's got axe kicks. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Here we go. Okay. Do it again. Bonk. Yep, that's fine. It's just to get off me. I am relying so... Oh, shit. I feel bad that I'm using the unsheathed so much. But, like, it is just chunking his ass down. I'll admit, I um, I had Cartoon Arc, but I didn't really watch as much, as much of those older ones as I would have liked looking back. But, yeah, it just happens, right? The little bit I did see of um Giant Bravo, though, I thought was pretty funny. I was trying to think, like... I mean, you know, Spongebob. I really love uh, Grim Ventures and Billy and Mandy. I feel like I have to look at a list. Oh, shit. I forgot. Uh, mm, uh. Sorry. I was going to do this. Let's go. Let's go. Just 
Look at that. Oh shit, I didn't think that would hit me. Oh shit. Damn. I'm getting greedy. Yep, I'm getting greedy. Yep, just gonna pop this now, cause why not? Oh shit. Need a refill on stamina. Boink. Womp. Womp. Up. Oh. Womp. Done. Oh no, I guess not. He says, I got one more wombo combo, bitch. Damn. Yeah, let him swing, let him swing. All right. Oh! Ah, survive. Heal again, just be safe. No! I fucked up on that. This'll do him. All right. Uh. Yeah, if we're talking favorite childhood cartoons, I... Damn it. I would not make it very far without bringing up Billy and, ben uh, Billy and Mandy. Whoop! Ah, that's right, the secondary combo. Damn it. <sighs> yep, I, I got greedy near the end there, and he just rocked me. That's okay. That's okay. We got five more of these to use. Let's see. Courage was really good. It was genuinely a creepy show, too. I loved it. I remember if, as a kid, a few of those, like, giving me nightmares. A few of those episodes, I mean. I'm sorry. Would you, is, are you okay if you grab me my... Ah, oh, there's nothing in it. Never mind. I got lucky there. Bunk. We just did the same thing in a row. Like, we just did the same thing there. Yeah, we can keep we can keep doing that circle. It's a it's a fine circle. Boink. <laughs> Sorry, just like doop, done. Yep, code names can code name kids next door. Yep, I remember you telling me about that. I, di I did watch it, yes. Dodge me, yep. Bad timing. God, I love, I love that splits. Damn. I love how when he jumps, he jumps, and then there's that second of him going, Hurr! as he comes towards you. That is, it's cinematic. I love it. But that first stage, though, we positively bullied him. Jillwood, hello. It's good to see you, and eh, not too, not too long. I still feel pretty good about this. I'm having a lot of fun with this guy like this this is a good time all right yeah pop the rune arc because why not we'll start by doing flame grant me strength let's go would it be better for me to have doubles maybe 
Sup? Ah, greedy. Oh, I thought you were going to do the big swingling so I could do that. Damn. Okay, this time I'm just going to heal. Shit! Damn. I did so well last time. What the fuck? It's because you got greedy. It's because I got greedy. Jeez. I'm gonna say your lawn's huge. That or you got the world's like smallest and most inefficient lawnmower. Although you doing okay? Says I'm doing fine. Don't worry about me. It's like okay. Soon. Ah. Yeah, that'd do it. Ten acres. Yeah, that that'd do it. Do you at least have a riding one, or is it a push one? Minch. Forget about that. Yeah, look at all those little spots that I can just get a nice quick hit in. There you go. And as I do this, I'll boost up like so. And get one of those in. Oh, I miss. Alright. Out there with a pair of scissors. I don't know. I have a push lawn mower. I use a push lawn. I've never used a riding lawn mower. Damn it! Ah! Gotta watch those grabs. Oh no. Bad timing. Just had a sliver of hit points. Yeah, fuck. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Ooh. I keep forgetting that I have it as a quick select. What? I love him. Oh my goodness, this guy's a lot of fun. This guy's great. Oh god. Okay. We're gonna run out of... Between this and the next guy, we're gonna run out of arcs, but... It's fine. It's just fine. Arlo, are you doing okay? He says, I'm stretching. I played with Molly, and I went on a long walk. It's nap time. Sorry. All right. Let's. Let's go. That was greedy. Nope. I am playing incredibly greedy.
Okay, there. because I know I can get a few free swings in here. <laughs> Bad timing. Shit. Okay, drink up. Drink up. Let him do his shit. I should not have done that. Shit. There you go. Dip Arlo's being fine. Let's see, gas in the motor's tank. Jeez. Sorry about that horror. I was looking at I was looking at my dog. Watch out for that one. And the big boy. And I mistimed that. Nope, just gotta, just gotta get away from him when he does this combo. No. Shit, shit, shit. Yeah, definitely it seems like dodging to his side instead of his just directly. Watch for the second. Get a free hit in. Come on. There you go. Watch this. Yep. Big boy explosion. And we're fine. Whoop. Watch for the stop. Nope. Nope. No. Ah, oh, damn it. Right back down. All right, he's probably going to follow up. Perfect. Oh, I almost had that. Yep, just block, block. Perfect. No! No, 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 no. Come on, come on, generation. Come on. Yeah, boy. Watch the follow up. Damn it! He was one drop away. Nope. You lay down, Arlo. He was one drop away. Nah. Arlo, you nibbling? Arlo's nibbling on. Ah, uh, he's uh, he's chewing on my hand. <laughs> Arlo, do you want to whore yourself out for the camera? You're so cute. Okay. One more arc. Yeah. Besides, besides that, like mistiming timing at the end, that felt really good. We had a lot of. I don't know if there's gonna be a stage three. There probably is, but we had a lot of flasks to spare. So I think. I think we got this in the bag. It's just about knowing when we can and can't be. Hey, look! It's the the Lionel armor or what? Lionel or whatever his name is. It's Red West's armor. <laughs> yeah, it's just about knowing when we can and can't be greedy. Oh, nope, I misclicked. Alright. Come on. There you go. Boom. Beautiful. Hit this, let the stamina go back up. Pop a spell, cause why not? Boink. Nope. All right. Hey, I was that you resemble that statement? <laughs> you said it's your armor. <laughs> I'm sorry, what, Mr. Lion? You were saying something? Anyways. Sorry, sorry, your your pet lion was doing what? Oh, shit.
Yep, just let, let him do his combo. Meh. Oh, no. Whoa. Watch for the second. And just kind of walk out of it. Nice and calm. Mm, I'm so mad. So angry. Watch for the second. That was probably greedy. That I shouldn't have done that. Out. At. Okay. Come on, let's go. Doink. Nope. Oh, that's death. That might not be death. Perfect. That roar. Damn it! Ah! That is the second time. Okay, giant bump. That is the second time, just inch of inch before death. That's not the right phrase. A sliver of health left. There we go. That's that's good grammar. I feel good about this. Oh no, we don't have any more whatever. Eh, it's fine. We'll live. But Max, you can't survive without your rune arc. It's like, no, we'll be fine. We'll, we'll be just fine. We're getting this guy down. That was an accident. Okay, is that the nope? Yeah, let the stamina refill. Ah, that was greedy. Yep, just land my stamina refill. I keep thinking that upward... Oh, shit. That might be death. I keep thinking that upward swing is an attack, but really it's just him winding up that he like a uh, heavy, if you will. Shit. This is me playing way too greedy. All right, he's a little easier to get away from in this form. I lied. So if there's a time to... That right there. Yeah, if there's a time to drink... Shit. Okay. Shit. We are not doing very good timing right now. Getting, getting way overconfident. Shit. That was that was so much overconfidence. That was so much moxie right there. Come on, we're better. We're better than that. Come on. Bad timing. Okay, that's a roar. That's okay. The roar doesn't actually hurt you, so... Wait, no. Nope. Uh, I thought he was going to do a... Number two. Yep, let him do his thing. Yep, that pushed me back. That's okay. Big boy explosion. Let's go. That's totally okay. Oh, no. That's less okay. Ugh. Oh, that's death. Yep, that's 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 okay. I didn't feel very good about that first phase. We could have done better. That's what you get when you say you don't need rune arcs. I don't know what he's doing. He's
He's like digging around in a in some of my jackets, <laughs> just like I didn't do nothing. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I really should. Do I have that? I should have that somewhere. Overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. That's exactly what happened. I got I got cocky. I got cocky and he wrecked me for it. Yeah, look at that. You don't even need to, you don't even need to roll. Ah, shit. When he does that big swing, you don't even need to roll. You just you just walk around him. Just like that. Ah, I thought I was blocking, but I guess not. Okay, this yeah, we're just gonna do that. Heal. And then we're gonna swing off. Shit. Nope. It's just hard to tell that that's what he's doing in that moment, you know what I mean? Alright. Damn it. I was hoping I could get the drink in. Oh, you can just walk away from that, huh? Oh, no. Like, that looks like a move I can't just walk away from. That was bad timing. I'm gonna heal just to be safe. Oh, my goodness. Oh! Oh, that probably would've killed me. I don't know what that move is. I, I say I know what that move is. Block, 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 just tank with the shield. Yeah, you, you can just walk away from that move. Oh, shit. He got me with his leg. Come on, come on. Bad timing. He's doing... Nope, no explosion. That is so weird to me that those grapples, you could just kind of... You could just walk away from. Just whole block. Whole block. Yep. It's not worth trying to roll it. Whatever follow-up he does, you can dodge with one dodge and, you know, good timing. No point in... No point in risking it. Boop. Boop, boop. And boop. Whoop, there you go. Okay, come on, whole block, whole block. Shit. Ooh, I had just too little stamina. Nope. Heal up, heal up. Terminated. Not yet. Not yet. Oh, he lived. Nope. Tarnished. <sighs> That was a lot of fun. Hey, Actually, I was gonna say a bathroom break. <laughs> I was gonna say, not just that, I was gonna say a bathroom break for me and Arlo, because I've been drinking a lot of water, thank you very much. Oh, that was fun. I really enjoyed now that. Would be a very good time to leave. I really enjoyed that. That really felt like fighting a barbarian. That, oh, that was fun. We also need to go back to, um. okay, wait, hold on. Let's, we're gonna, we're gonna touch all this. We're gonna rest here just in case something happens. Don't fall in. Ah, uh, what a good shot, camera wise. Yeah, let's, uh, real quick, another small bathroom break, and then we will be right back. That was a lot of fun, but.
Alright, and we're back. Sorry about that. Alright, Arlo, do you want to say hi to the camera? Arlo, do you want to say hi? Yeah. 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 Where's my $2, cat? Also, hi, Snowball. Yeah. Now, if only... Aw, you're, you're, you're biting my... Th Ow! <laughs> you just bit my arm. Yeah. He says, Daddy, why don't you trust me to not be in the room when you're screaming? And I say, oh, I don't know, puppy. Let, let me, let me list, let me list the reasons. Let, let me, let me list the reasons why I might not trust you to, why I might not trust you by yourself. <sighs> okay, number one, you still pee on the floor sometimes. I don't think you do it intentionally, but I think you do. Number two. You chew on things, including cords. <laughs> Number three, you're too cute, and I need to I need to make sure the internet sees just how lovely you are. Oh. Yeah, you and your psycho blue eyes, look at you. Alright. We're gonna go we're gonna go see what the remembrance is, and then we're gonna go get our ass handed to us by the final boss, Arla. Is it that right? Sorry. No, no, don't mind me. This is just too cute. <laughs> no. Okay. Uh, Jail, I don't know if you're still there, if you're out mowing, but if you are, can you confirm if there are any other bosses for us to do? He is so cute. Can you confirm for us if there are any other bosses for us to do? Because I... Oh, nope. You chewing on the controller. <laughs> because I think... I think we're oop oop shoot. Cause I think we're there. I think this is it. Hello. Better not chewing my I like I like that microphone. Remembrance of Horaloo. Oh, I forgot to look at this. Uh Milliketh was a shadow bound beast given given to his Empyrean. What? Merrick's sole need of her shadow was a vessel to lock away destined death. Even then, she betrayed him. Hmm. Uh, Mikuela and Millennia. They are both Imperians with suffered afflictions from birth. One was cursed with the eternal childhood, and the other harbored and wrought within. Mikuela. Okay. Oh. Uh. Yep, I would have to see your trophies to be sure. Yeah, I made him fight it. We can look at my trophies real quick. But I just want to see what this is. Alright, Regal Roar. This weapon is a symbolic of Godfrey's vow to conduct himself as a lord, later becoming an emblem of the golden lineage. In the days of the past, a crown was warranted with strength. A loose mighty war. Strong, strong attack becomes a lunging slash. Ooh. Uh, grants an armament the heavy affinity and the following skill. Horaloo's Earth Shaker. Slam both hands onto the ground to violently shake the earth and unleash shockwave. Follow up with additional input to slam the ground again. It's freaking sick. Alright, um... Where do we look at trophies? Okay, there it is. View all achievements. Close that. Okay. Uh, do you need me to go slow or can I go like relatively fast? So. Uh. Market, red, god skin. Okay, so there's three hidden. Acquire all legendary talisman, acquire all legendary sources and incantations, acquire all legendary ash remains, acquire all legendary. I'm not worried about any of those. So there's three hidden ones. So I don't know. I imagine I imagine they have to do with endings, maybe, or I'm I'm not sure. I'll go through them again slowly in case you're like, Max, what about blah, blah, blah. Yeah, there's Godfrey the First Lord, yeah. Uh, yeah, there are three endings. Oh, perfect. So I'd say in that case, we're good to go. Let's make this party happen.
No rune arcs, nothing to lose. Oh, wait, we can level up. Oh, wait, oh, shit. Uh, wait, no, sorry, 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 I lied, I lied, I lied. I lied, I lied. Make sure no one's texting me that they're dying. Nope, okay. Um, we looked at his, um, we looked at what we can get for his soul. We didn't look at what we could get for his equipment. <gasps> you can get his hair! Oh my goodness, he led the war against the giants, faced the storm load, his lord alone, and then there came a moment when his last word the enemy fell, and it was then as the story was told that the hue of Lord Godfrey's eyes faded. Aww. Holy shit. Holy shit. Bass. Max, are you ever going to wear any of it? No. Yeah. You go, and then that, and then whatever Xbox control square is. What? All right. Um, can I get five hundred runes? Nope. Hold on. Where is the salesman girl? To get to the table. Ah. So it is. You got me there, champ. Alright, hold on. Uh, you offer a bell offering. Can't you, can't you sell shit? No, wait. No, no, no. I don't think it's, um... You can sell shit to the merchants. I think thing right i just need 500 souls literally i just want 500 souls so i can level up one more time Wait. Well, you're back. yeah okay uh what's something i do not plan on using ever perfect um i still have a bunch of them um Dish. No. Um. What's something I, I can I can sell that I'll never ever use and I won't feel bad about it? Probably these. To be honest. Do I have enough? I don't know. Uh, probably these. Nah, I definitely have enough. All right. Three of the endings are rolled into one trophy. Oh, okay. All right, level up. We'll put our last one into endurance. Final level is 173. Someone out there is going to tell me, Max, you're over leveled. To which I say, I'm still getting my ass whooped. So as long as I'm getting my ass whooped, I'm not over leveled. Uh, none? I'm pretty happy with what I got. I think I'm happy with what I got. Let's do this shit. <sighs> Touch the Jeebus light. Touch it. Just. Sephiroth is about to become God. Hi! Arlo, are you chewing on my curtain? He's looking at me like, no. Hi! Why are you impaled again? That's right, America is Radagon. That was the big thing. Oh my goodness, are you okay? Do you need first aid? <laughs> oh, that's scary. Because Chaos Moon either pee pee poo poo man, death by companion, not another. Hi. Well, it looks like color's coming back to your cheeks, so that's. 
Lovely. Hi. My name's Max. Nice to meet you. You burnt her alive. Well, Radagon of the Golden Order. Now listen, I think we could talk about this and uh, you could understand my situation. Holy shit. We could talk about this, right? Okay. Well, is, isn't it kind of both? I'm sorry, I was... No, nope. Arlo, you quick chewing on the sound curtains. He literally just looked at me like, what are you talking about? This is fun, Arlo. I don't want to have to do doggy discipline on camera. You quit chewing on those curtains. But, um, nah, I was just, I was just staring in delight. I'm just looking at like, look at all these blood stains. Yeah. Get a spray bottle out. I'm gonna have to. Mid fight. All right, round two. Wow, I do a lot of damage to you. Wow, I do a lot of damage to you. Backstab. Get out of that. Okay. Damn. You covered for yourself. Did it, did it. Oh shit. Oh shit, you got teleports. Shit. Heal, 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 heal. Nope, nope. Ding dong. No second stage at half health. Noted. Damn. Shit. Hi. Oh no. Ah, right, that's a risk. Nope. Nope. He is smithing a rune arc. All right. Ah, I was too close. Hi. Boop. Ow. Oh, I did not think that. Ah, okay. We almost got him, though. We almost got him. I feel pretty good about that. Let's see. Uh. You're lucky she's not going full Enderman surrounded by water to teleport. <laughs> that is fair. Just like the d -d 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 all around. Granted, it'd also be like screaming in pain and everything, but. Arlo, you need to calm down. You need to calm down. He says, No, I wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I love the bright light each time. It, it, it gives a sense of scale. You know what I mean? Whoop. Whoop. Whoop.
I also love that that attack, like you don't you don't necessarily take damage, but you still fly across the arena. Ding dong. That was bad timing, but we got away with it. Damn. <laughs> Says, fuck your jumps. Fuck your unsheath. Fuck your healing. <laughs> uh, this, okay. I know I'm dying, but this doesn't seem that bad. No. Oh, uh, yeah, because she puts out light on the floor at her teller and it hurts. She did that on me in my last run for the chaos. <laughs> but, um, this honestly doesn't seem that bad. This isn't, like, weirdly hopeless. You know what I mean? This this, this this is good fun. And also, once again, I'm gonna get a spray bottle. You know you're not supposed to do that. He, he looks at me because he knows. He knows. Uh, you still got another fight after. I figured. I figured. I'm okay with it. Yeah, this... This is this is good fun. Damn. Damn. That's bad. Okay, maybe I should stop doing that move. Shit. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, look at all these openings. I forgot. Yep. Hey, right, come on. I need to stop doing that move. I need to. Nope. Oh. I need to stop doing that move. No, oh wait, oh wait, oh wait. Um. Shit. Okay. What do you think about this? We got this. We got this. It'll be fine. It'll be, it'll be fine. It's fine. Is it though? Yeah. Probably. Also, notably, I could summon a mimic in there, but once again, that feels wrong. Simple as that. It it feels wrong, so I won't do it. Oh my goodness, you see how much damage that was. Dunk. Yep, just let you just let you do that cool move. Boop. Yep. That almost could have killed me. Swing batter batter. <laughs> I love that so much. Whoop. Boink. Yep. 
Yeah, there's an odd amount of time where you can do that. Okay, I'm gonna heal just to be safe. Here we go. Holy sh shit. All right, we're good, we're good. It explodes, I keep forgetting it explodes. Oh, that's bad. Damn it. Okay, yep. grill. Damn it. Yep, that's all explosion. Oh, God. Nope. Jeez. That was risky. I'm about to pay for it. worth it. I'm almost out of heals though. If there's another fight after this, this is going to be not good. Okay, worth the heal. Nope. Bad timing. Okay. Shit. Nice! Holy shit! I just got baited! He left himself open, teleported, and punished me. That was gross! <laughs> He's fine. That... That was gnarly! Wow! Well played. But still, that... Mmm... That didn't feel good. That, okay. In terms of like me looking back as like a duel, that was awesome. But having it done to me, I feel styled on that. That didn't feel good. Ah, shit. Wow, he has all sorts of styling on me. Damn it. I keep thinking I'm out of range. I'm not. I just wasted three hit heals and I got one hit on him so far. Didn't even get to use my boost. There. Get out. Oh god. Okay. Gotta get out. Yep, you're creating zones of safety for you, which is gross. Bad timing. Yep. I should have waited. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Nope. Thought I could roll out of it.
that is what I wanted to do earlier. What I just did right there. Just a cheeky little... Yeah, I'm gonna drink up just to be safe, because shit, my man. Nope. Okay, quick, go, 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 go. Oh, we're not done. We're not done. Oh, that is fun. I really like that, but... God. Oh. He's, v he's very good with those AoEs. He's very good at covering for him. That's Dark Souls 1. I'm pretty sure this music is Dark Souls 1. Space Dragon. God is a space. God is a space dragon. This is the multiverse of trees. Holy shit. God is a space dragon. I know, it's beautiful. Elden. Whoa, whoa. Elden Beast. What a magnificent and beautiful creature. Press at the end of all. Ow. Okay. For the record, I am out of healing items. So we're probably not going to make this. But you know what? We're still going to try. Shit. What a beautiful creature. Oh, I'm sorry. Hang on. <laughs> ah, that one got me. Hey, right, get over here. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. Wow, and its whole body glows every time you slap it. Oh, I love it. Okay, so you're a lot tankier. That's noteworthy. Okay, noted. You have it. You have an implosion, or I guess it's just a normal explosion. But wow. I'm gonna have to kill. I'm gonna have to kill human god again, aren't I? I know it's what you said earlier, Jail, but still, it's the, it's dawning on me. I'm gonna have to do it again. Oh no. <laughs> just, just very quietly. Oh no. Yep. to do a critical on God. Do that boost again. Do the boost again. Do the boost again. Do the boost again. No. Ah, that, that was me getting greedy. What? Oh, bullshit. 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 I dodged that. Ah. 
that's not God. I'm pretty sure it's God. I'm pretty sure that gooey, beautiful celestial dragon thing is God. I implore you to tell me otherwise. <laughs> pretty sure it's God. <laughs> pretty sure when you go to heaven, right? At the pearly gates, that's what you see. It's just, it's just that. But Max, you said during the last game it's Mother Miranda. Nah, it changed my mind. It's, it's this goo god thing. Greed. Avarice. Overconfidence. That's good. The old beast is, but the person you just fought is not God. So, alright, okay, we need, okay, explain the lore then, because they just made this big deal about Radagon is Merica, and Merica, or Marika, or whatever, is God, right? So is that giant dragon thing Merica? Or what is this thing in relation to America then? That was bad. I love it when you do that move. It gives me so much time for activities. No. No. Stop. Whoop. 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 No. Damn. Hey! <laughs> hey! Did it again. No. Oh, God, it worked. No! Boink. Oh shit. Oops. Boink. Let's see. The little gold thing inside is the Elden Beast and that god that just resides in them. So, oh, that's why he has that goo arm. But then like... Oh, so when he dies, it gets let out. So he was holding God inside of him. Why is he no hold God inside of him, though? It's just so pretty. And I, and I love hearing that Dark Souls song. Bitch, let's go! <laughs> no, don't refire me. Don't refire me. Don't refire me. No. I barely got any hits in. Oh, I don't know what's going on. I'm scared. I'm gonna run. I just blocked God. I just blocked three of God's slashes. Oh God, you just did something. I don't know what it was though. I have no idea what you did. Oh God. That was pretty sick. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> like, fuck this corpse in particular. <laughs> oh. I love how it's a big amoeba and it has like just one little eye and you can see it from- Ah, oh, it's so cool! Anyways, let's bully the shit out of Radical. <laughs> now that we know that, once again, Unsheath is just broken. It is just so broken. There's- there's no- there's no getting around how broken it is. Especially with, um, Alexander's shard, it's even more broken now. Bad timing. I actually, 
bad. Yeah. That's greedy. I shouldn't have done that. Roll out. Ah! That was almost really cool. I almost got him before he teleported out. Ah. So no critical? Oh no. Oh no. Alright, so, so no so no critical. So, so no no critical bullshit. Get away from that. Shit. Hi. How's it going? I love this move. Wow. Oh. I'm still alive. Bitch I lit oh. Oh. Okay, Honest Crusher Brigade, does it bug you guys when I'm, like, clearly just having too much fun being silly with the boss instead of just, like, being 100% serious mode trying to kill him? Because I'm, I'm enjoying this. I think this is great fun. Compared to Malekith earlier, th these, these bosses are so much more enjoyable. <laughs> nope. All right, good. I, I was just concerned that you're not like, oh my goodness, Max, just actually try to win. Quit being silly and giggling that he just nailed you to the ground. You know, like, quit, you know, quit being dumb. Put on the armor that you know is better. Damn. Damn. Woo. 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 Still got you. Yeah, I'm just gonna kind of get just the tip of my sword up in there. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, that's bad. This might be death. Yep. Ah, gal. I have to remember. Nice shot. I have to remember when he does like that big thing, I can't just roll backwards because it hits and then there's like a wave and it's really hard to dodge both of those in one go. It's better to run towards him so that he fires it past you. I think that's the ticket. I think. It's kind of hard to tell. But yeah, the, the amount of damage we can chunk away with each slash is incredible. So that's why I'm just trying to capitalize on that. Boop. No. And also, you know, try and get the parry in, or the critical in. Yeah. Damn! Shit! Yeah, he got he got me there, fair and square. Yeah. Jeez. All right, let's go. Be. Should I use the... We'll give it a few more tries before switching to the double slash because... I... Ah, uh, well against the dragon, the double slash is really good against dragons. Is it though? It's more cost effective because they don't move as much. But against him? I kind of get the feeling it won't be. OK, 
Because, like, right there, right? We couldn't stay in for very long. Shit. Okay, towards him. Yeah, let him throw it past you. Right there might have been an opportunity to double slash, but he doesn't... The dude doesn't get stunned. Oh shit. Damn. Damn. Also, do I need to turn my phone on silent? Because it is vibrating a lot and I apologize. Okay, I apologize about that. But, um. See, uh, I know I've had this debate so many times on this show, but I really like Double Slash. And. I think that's just what it ultimately comes down to. Like, Double Slash assumes that you will either stun them or you will have enough time to sit there and go bum 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 bum. And we can't promise that. And since we can't promise that, it's not worth it. While with Unsheath, sure, it's, you know, it costs more. It costs more and theoretically, you know, pound for pound, in an open environment where you're not getting the shit kicked out of you like right now pound for pound maybe it does more damage it's ultimately not worth it I wanted to... Oh, no. Okay, towards him, towards him. Oh, no. Hi. And shkadunk. Oh, shit. Bad timing. Ow. All right, it's a little bit of a waste, but if there's a time to drink these, it's right now. Oh, well, thank you. That's very kind. Anyways, hi, God. My name's Max, and we need to have words. I don't think, it, uh, no, looks like his back was a sa- It's a shark. I love that. It's not just a dragon. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, uh, bad timing. That was bad timing. But their generation's kicking in, so it's all good. This song is, like, exactly like someone from Dark Souls 1, and I'm not entirely sure who. Yeah, there's a lot of big boy damage when we do that. Alright, God, do you bleed? Oh, that's something different. That. What? 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 That was awesome! Shit! Shit! I lived. <laughs> I l that was so cool. Oh, and all the trees and the bat. Oh, I love this. I love everything about this. Oh, fuck. Yeah, now that. I don't even know what just killed me there, but that was so cool. Sorry, visually. Visually, this boss is an absolute delight. And I was like, Max is a giant goop dragon with a bunch of wings and... Whatever, it's boring. No one likes it. No, I love this shit. This is so cool. But like, I, I love the idea of it hold or it breathes out or it holds out his hand or whatever and shoots out the cosmos. Blinding you 
with the stars. Like, how is that not hype as fuck? But now we know, so if he does that, he's gonna do a big shock wave, so we need to be able to roll over that. And if he does the um if he goes into the sky and it's all beautiful and pretty, he's creating a he's creating a ring, so we gotta like get out of that ring as quickly as possible. Alright, let's go. Yep. Damn it. It's bad timing. There we go. I was gonna say, assuming I don't whiff, or assuming he whiffs it. That grab is so much free money. Damn. Assuming I can make it so he whiffs it. That grab is free money. Can't get cocky. Cannot get cocky. I haven't said this yet, but thank you everyone so much for watching. I hope y'all are having fun with this. This is, to my knowledge, the final boss of the game, but I'm, oh, I'm sad to see this game end. It's, it's, it's bittersweet, but I'm having a lot of fun. That's the important thing. I always feel like this at the end of games that, you know, we spend how many, how many streams at. I'm sad to see it go. Oh. Yeah, it looks like if you like just run behind him, you don't even really need to dodge because he'll just decide that hitting the ground. Why do I keep doing that? He just decides that hitting the ground is more profitable. Shit. Ah! Okay, we're gonna need to heal again. Perfect time. Ah, uh, probably a little bit of a waste, but that's okay. Ah, uh, I keep doing that. Boop. Work on that spacing. Damn. Damn. Ah! Can't. Okay, go towards his shadow arm. Which makes sense considering the what the other arm is. Shit. Okay. We're golden. Okay, we're not golden. What the fuck? Why are we not golden? Whoop. 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 Did it again. I keep falling for that shit. Yeah, almost. Yeah, I'll, I'll just let him get away with that one. Yep, hold it. I'll just do a nice little thing right there. Drink this up. Okay, uh, Jail said you, let's see, it's a good rule of thumb to only try and use about three flasks on the first. I used a lot more than that. If you could just breathe fire over there, that'd be great. Oh god. Eh, 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 eh. Yep, completely safe. Watch out for that, and then he's gonna do a big old blast. Okay. Fair and square, you got me. I don't know what that move is. Oh. I'm not entirely sure what that was. But it was cool. 
And I missed. Oh, I actually got you. Eh, 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 eh. All right. Watch those slashes. Unless this is something cool. Oh, it's so pretty. Sprint, just sprint, just run, just run, just run, just run, just run. Okay, we have to try to dodge that and then get out before it explodes. All right, do big, sl do big slashes. Okay, not what I thought you were gonna do. All right, you got me. Okay, I don't know what that does, but I'm just gonna keep running. Great, uh, I don't know what I just did, but it worked. Great, that's your explosion. Good shit. Almost jumped on top of you there. Okay, run, 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 go, 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 go. Hey, we're good. Oh, hi. You crucified me. That was rude. Oh shit, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that does. Okay, okay. Am I supposed to target that bitch? What am I supposed to do? When does it stop? Wow, that lasted a really long time. That lasted a really long time. I can't get out. Okay, there. Come on, keep doing those big physical slashes. We love to see it. We love to see it. If you could bleed right now, that'd be awesome. You're probably immune to bleeding because you're a god and that'd be symbolic. But, you know. Okay, might as well just wait. So cool. Wait until the ring forms and just walk towards it. Walk towards it. Walk towards it. Get out of the explosion radius. Okay! Damn it! Ugh. We got really close there and we went in with, sub, uh, with a suboptimal amount of flasks. So I'll throw that out there. What a cool boss. Like, okay, it has the problem that, um... This is actually in the same conversation. I mentioned this earlier when I was talking to Ethan about what our favorite, uh, like, Souls-like games are in general, I should just say. Because I included, like, Neo and stuff. But, um... We were talking about what makes a Souls-like a Souls-like, and the biggest aspect that we thought of, you know, just us bullshitting, right? Was that... In these games, you always know why you died. You know, obviously, nothing's perfect, but that's a theme. You should always know why you died. There you go. You know, the, the theory is that's fair. At the end of the day... At the end of the day, it's fair. But dragons usually kind of break that rule because it's a dragon and also because many times the camera kind of fucks you over. And the Elden Beast has that problem that the camera is kind of your enemy sometimes. I was hoping for the stun. I got really lucky there. a little bit away from him. I lived. I should not have lived, but I lived. That was bad timing. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Jeez. He just ripped me a new one there. 
you know, even if we look at like some of these moves and we're like, oh, they're they're bullshit. Like, they're stringing them together, and this is really difficult. Theoretically, at the end of the day, you can look at it and be like, okay, you know, I died, and this is why. Fair is fair, right? Or at least that's the hope. I'm gonna, yep. I'm about to go into Elden Beast working with even less flasks. Yep. Alright. I'm gonna go in with just about nothing. Drink that shit. Alright, let's go. Wait, this is a poor decision. Why did I do this? Run away! Run away! Okay. Come pop back up. Alright. If I run towards him fast enough, maybe he won't do the swings. Ah, it's that delay. It's that delayed one that gets me. Bitch. Um. Oh, that's it. Okay. I was going to say, I don't know what you're doing, but I'm scared. I love it when you attack with your sword, though. That shit's easy to dodge. I just go over here to your butt. Yeah, you can see I'm kind of fighting with the camera a little bit. Okay. Okay, go, go, go. Yeah, it, it, it doesn't hurt that much, which is good, but it stuns you, and that's the problem. Delay that shit. And I still whiffed it, but that's okay. Blocking is better than taking it fully. That's just a big explosion. Yep. Gotta let my stamina refill. Bad timing. Uh, oh shit. Alright. Just go, 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 just go. Just keep running. Sure we didn't get any damage off of that, but we lived. And I missed. And jump. Shit. Go, 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 go. Shit. No, 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 not the shooting star, not the shooting star. Damn it. Yep, I had to heal. I don't know if I have a way to, like, kill that thing, but that thing is a nightmare to deal with. Which is made worse by, I remember the one spell we got that I think it needed some absurd amount of faith. And I was like, let's try it. What does it do? Ah, it shoots out a little light ball that, like, shoots out a bajillion little, a bajillion little whatevers. That's freaking useless. And then he uses it. And it just annihilates me. Yeah, we're getting there. Arlo just realized where the treats are. I do have a spell to get rid of that spell. I might have that spell, actually. Would it be worth looking into? Might be. Damn it. Arlo. No. Yep, he just learned where the treats are, so he's like, what if I just jump up and get them? I'm so clever. Roll out. Bad timing. Nope. 
punk. I know you stop. I think I might know what he's kind of barking about. But we can't take care of it right now. Because <sighs> I'm getting my butt. Alright, right, I got on. Here's a flex. And I mistimed it. <laughs> Yo. Shoot. If I had to guess, Megan just got off work. So that's why he want that's why he was whining. Bad dodging. And thank goodness he missed. There. Alright. Okay. Half down on all supplies. Half down on all supplies. Whew. Let's go kill a dragon. Yep, he's doing the big breath. Shit. Okay, good, that's just the explosion. Yeah, run towards him. We don't want him to. We don't want him to tax us. All right, run more towards the center. Shield out. Wow, you can get away with that. You can just get away with holding block. Nice. All right. Oh. Well, I got away pretty scot free with that. All things considered. Run towards him. What's he gonna do? Shit. I right, just go, just go, just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. And you gotta be ready to catch that. Nice. Alright. And good to know you can just block that. And I missed. And I missed again. Eh, 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 eh. Whew. All right. Yep, just, just, just gonna run. Just gonna run. Yeah. Hi. Oh shit. Alright, that was pretty sick actually seeing that. Boop. Uh, nope. I was saying, is that a grab? Hey, that was just an in general one. Noted he can do that. Alright. I don't know if that was a waste or not, but he's giving me time, so might as well, right? Shit. 
Get that ball away from me. Get that ball away from me. It is so good at just taxing. Oh, it actually slows you down too when you're in it. <sighs> okay. So good to know when the... God, that is pretty. Good to know that when the ball is active, you can just run. You can just run. So that's good to know. Uh, everyone give me... I'm not even going to hit break. I'm going to give me like 10 seconds. I'll be right back. Okay, that's all good. It's all good. It was it was Megan, so Arlo will be a little happier now. And Molly says, "I walked into the office because it was opened, but now I don't want to be in here." It's gonna be Max, Max yelling about killing some blacksmith and then trying to take on God. Here we go. Alright, let's go blacksmith. Shit. I didn't think he'd actually catch me with it. Wow. Okay. Great. Alright. There we go. That's what I wanted. I got lucky. Gotta make sure to actually hit him in the front. No, that was a bad decision. That was a bad decision. I thought I could get away with some shit. Heal, heal, heal. All right, we're good. Damn. Okay, we're good. Watch for that second explosion. Swing. Swung. No counter swing. All right, a little better than last time. Just as quickly as possible, every boost. Every single boost we can, just pump it out. I don't think we got to fire one off, but fuck it, too late, doesn't matter. He's gonna start breathing. We need to get as much free. Nope, nope, nope. We need to get as much free damage as we can. Yep, just as much free damage. Okay, run. Just run. Just run. And then be ready to do... Okay. I say the moment we're out of that running, he's, he's going to try to pop something. Ah. Just run, take the block, and run out. I probably won't be able to get away with that as easily when he does the three-tier version of it, but it's worth a shot. Okay. Way later than I thought it was.
Okay, the regeneration's working, which is great. Got him in the arm, or kind of hard to tell. Ooh, okay, that's worth healing. Maybe a little wasteful because of regeneration, but... And the music just picked up. All right. Oh, shit. Get, get, get. Stab God. Stab it. Yeah. Get some extra slashies in. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Run, 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 run. Okay, shit. Okay, we just, we just need to run. We just need to run. What? It's sped up. At least it doesn't interrupt me healing, but that thing's sped up. I saw it. That's bullshit. drink this okay here's the big boy he says look at the look at the logo okay are we gonna get away with this yes you can get away with it you could just run through it while holding block beautiful actually a lot of his moves if all you do is just like Run horizontally. Just sprint horizontally. Oh my goodness, that's the secret to all of his long range moves. Just lock onto him and run horizontally. Or just jump over the rings. You can jump over the rings? You can play Sekiro? What the fuck am I doing? What the fuck am I doing? You can just... And you're done. Round three. Round three, you beautiful, magnificent creature. Let's go. What? No, round three. No, come on. No, come on. Round three. Wait, was that it? Wait, 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 hold on. Was that it? Oh, shit. That was it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was fun. I enjoyed that. That, that was good. Unsheath MVP. Unsheath MVP. Hold on. Hold on. Hewn into the Elden Tree. Ah. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the finger rear. Alternatively, it can be used to gain a great boundary of runes. If it was the vassal beast of the greater will and living incarnation of the concept of order. Wow. Okay, so hold on. Before I do anything. Oh, thank you. Before we do anything. That was a lot of fun. I really, really enjoyed that. Now, before we do anything, right? Wow. Okay, we can go to the Grace and check out the souls. All right, cool. I want to make sure about that. All right, all right. So, this isn't going to... Don't touch. No. <laughs> okay, so... So we can go. This isn't going to be like Dark Souls 2, was it? Was it 2? Where if you like left after killing the final boss, they're like, Welp, sucks to suck, bitch. Guess you chose the bad ending. I, I got to see what this is. America's Hammer. Another faith weapon. Stone Hammer made in the lands of the Newman. Outside the lands between, the tool with which Queen Merica shattered the Elden Ring and Radagon attempted to repair it. Why did Queen Merica shatter the ring? 
Uh, the, the hammer partially broke upon Shattering Ring, becoming splintered with rune fragments. Leap up high, and while suspended midair, imbue the rune shard with light before smashing down hardly on the heroic Radagon's signature attack. Or... Another awesome faith weapon. It's a great sword. Sword wrought from the remnants of a god who should have lived a life eternal. Thoughts on what the weapon portends are many and varied. Some consider it the mark of a great sin or a sign of great devastation. Some think it as an end of an age, while others the beginning. Imbue the sword with bygone golden glory that then fired a foes, a wide gold wave, finds a foes, sweeping through all enemies' concept. Don't I have that as an ability already? It's like a smaller version, but like you go, eh, yeah, and it like puts holy on your blade for a little bit. I might have that, actually. Wow. I'm holding on to it. Uh, do I get any... Nope. I'm not even going to spend the souls. I'm not, I'm not even going to spend the souls. That was a lot of fun that was a really good time wow wait so where's the oh fracture america Man, my money's my money's over there okay so all right so jail where's my money okay so i just want i just want to look around I'm really, I'm really hesitant to touch anything right now, but like, okay. So this is, this is for my knowledge and for everyone's knowledge at home, right? So how do you do each ending? I'm guessing summon Ranny right now. That was the Ranny ending. But what happens if you touch, what happens if you touch it? For the ending you want now, click on the sign that said Ranny. Right, but like, what happens if I touch it? Oh, it's hair. Yeah, so like, what, what, how would I do the, uh, how would I do the death ending? How would I do the pee pee poo poo man ending? How would I do the. Sorry, this, these, these are the questions I, these are the questions I ask. I hope the first. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Look look at this look at this thing that I got here. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Alright. Let's summon Randy. Oh god. What form is she gonna be in? Hey, girl. How's it going? What the fuck am I doing here? You touch everything. Burns other things. You just touch it if you want to all touch any progress on that quest line. Then the touch together. The over, I see. Okay. <sighs> Go. Can't believe I got it at the end. Like, sorry, I didn't even realize. It's just kind of like, oh, shit, this house almost down. One more drop. Oh, oh. Wait, so you are in your doll form. Not your one true form that we put the ring on. But you do have the ring, I see. Guess that means we're married. This is awkward. Next. I do solemnly swear to every living being and every living soul. Now cometh the age of the stars, a thousand year voyage mm. under the wisdom of the moon. Bloodborne, bloodborne, bloodborne. Here blood beginneth the chill born. night that encompasses all, reaching the great beyond. Blood board, blood board, blood board. Doubt and loneliness. I don't know if we did a good thing. <laughs> That's the look on the, my face of like, wait, 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 hold on. What? Darkness straight into the stars? Loneliness? What? Fear? Doubt? Wait, what? What did I just sign up for? 
I can't even see your face. I don't even know what your second face is. I, I still don't know. Oh, hi, hi, girly. How's it going? Well, then, shall we? Okay, why is, what am I supposed to do with the second hand? Like, okay, taking the one hand. I could take... Which hand do I grab? I'm going to grab the upper hand. <laughs> so if I understand this correctly... I just got achievement Age of the Stars. Oh! Alright, so if I understand this correctly, lore-wise... I really don't know how to identify what star what stuff was Jaramar and what stuff is Hidetaka Miyazaki, but what a fucking amazing game. Yeah, if, okay, if I'm, if, if I'm understanding this lore-wise, we just fucked off to the moon for a thousand years because everyone's better off without us, and presumably when we come back, we'll be better, or we'll know more about the celestial beings or the star beings or the... We fucked off and the world's gonna turn to Bloodborne, right? That's the rules. Everything becomes Bloodborne. The beast clergy probably goes nuts. I don't know. I, I, I fuck. <laughs> no, but wow. What an incredible game. That was, oh, I got tickles all over. I am, that feels weird when I say that, but. Oh, that was so good. I loved that. Uh, I feel bad. I like to apologize for all the endlessly trying different armor. Music's so dope. I would like to apologize for all the endless trying different weapons, trying different armor, trying different spells, but at the end of the day, I just wanted my sword. I just wanted the power-up spell and maybe throw in a lightning bolt. I thought you said tinkles, not tickles. Tingles. Like, I got goosebumps. I have, there, I have goosebumps. Ah, uh, just wow that I absolutely adore that now I do need to give some criticisms okay I do need to give some criticisms there definitely is as the game Bobby there definitely is as the game goes I don't know how to describe it like there's it really is like everyone's Writer, producer, and then producer. Yeah. It really is, like, as the game goes on, armor becomes less and less and less of a factor. And it's all about hitting first, hitting as hard as possible, and just overpowering each other. It felt like most bosses were glass cannons. That if you could get the combo in, you would just... And that would be it. Like against the fight with, um, with uh, Alexander. Like, he was, he looks like this big tanky dude, and I just went up and did one double slash combo, and he was almost dead. It was like, oh. It feels like enemies have that a lot on you, and that you have that a lot on them, depending on, like, the situation. But overall, like, it's... A, actually, really, yeah, just, like, enemies... You could kill them stupid quickly, but they could kill you stupid quickly. So I'm not sure about that. Um... Maybe that's how it's meant to be, which, if if that's the case, fair enough. Um, the other thing that really that really struck me about this game. I'm trying to, I'm reading all the words and I'm having train of thought issues. Okay. Another issue with this game is that, especially in the catacombs, and especially, uh, in the caves as well, but the catacombs specifically, I just want to bring it up. Gaul shit got repetitive. It got so unbelievably repetitive. Now, maybe maybe part of that is because they don't expect you to do every single one. And I don't think we even did. We probably did most of them. But I don't think we did every single one. But, Gaul, they got real samey. And I was getting some Bloodborne Chalice Dungeon flashbacks. And not in a good way. And overall, like... Okay, so we are going to do... I, I want this... Oh. Oh, the voices. I want this stated. Jim Johnson as the dung eater. <laughs> Sorry. But, um. Seeing if I recognize any of these names. I probably do, and I don't realize it. Jimmy Livingston as the narrator was so good. But, um. Oh. 
But, um... We're gonna... Okay, so we are gonna do one more stream of this. Guaranteed one. No, one more. In which we're gonna do a tier list. I actually have the files, because, um... The one that's on the tier list website... There's a good one for bosses, but there's not a very good one for um, NPCs and for enemies. So I have to, I'm have to, i going to have to sit down and manually make it. But we are going to tier list all NPCs, all enemies, and all bosses. But what really struck me in this game was that a lot of the enemies are functionally the same. And they're reused a lot. Now I get it. The foot soldier, the basic soldier, the knight makes sense that there's a bunch of them and there's different variations so there's a certain amount of me going all right fine but it just felt like there are a lot of enemies that's like oh look it's the dogs again oh look it's more imps well nymphs are in imps are in catacombs yeah there's more of them now oh look there's worm faces here because why and some of them were just infuriating the the fucking stone statue cats screw those things i hated them and maybe there's like, um, maybe there's like general lore reasons that I just missed for each one being in each place. But sometimes it did feel kind of random of like, okay, we're in the snow world. Okay, yep, there's the things that were corrupted with Scarlet Rot previously. Why are they here now? And stuff like that. So yeah, I would say some of the catacombs got kind of annoying and repetitious. And sometimes the enemies are repetitious. I wish there was a lot more variety in enemies. Now I get it. Making them is hard. There's only so many ways someone can hit you with a stick or punch you or eat you or, you know what I mean? It's a big area. I get it. The game is kind... I think the game assumes you're not going to do everything. So that's why it's more okay with it being repetitive. Because, like... You know, if we want you to run into this enemy X amount of times. And if you barely play in Kaled at all, you just manage to accidentally get to Redan, beat him, and then leave... Then it's, uh, you know, we, we want you to enjoy all the different types of enemies. Uh, Vulgar Militia were another one. Vulgar Militia were everywhere. And I don't even know why. But they were. So, that kind of got me. Um, what else? What else? What else? I really wish you could slot a second skill. Like, I don't know how it should be controlled. I don't know if it should work like the, um, I don't know if it should work like the talisman system where instead of like attaching to items you just have like a left and a right one that i really wish you could slot to because then i would stop endlessly going do i have a sheath or do i have bleh? do i yeah do i have unsheath or do i have double slice or why don't i have the harry carry or what it really felt like there are so many cool abilities and cool weapons and cool everything that I felt like I couldn't use all of it. You know what I mean? Uh, same with the... Uh, uh, it was the thought that I had with the uh, Wondrous Physic, right? And with the Spirits, too, for that matter. There are so many different kinds... Uses Oodle? What the heck is Oodle? But there are so many different kinds of, like, the Physic things. And I only ever got two slots. So I feel like I couldn't use them all. I, I got Regeneration and Stamina Regeneration. I was just like, done. If you do not start over now, you could choose to begin Journey 2 later at the Table of Lost Grace in the Round Hope Toast. Let's not for now. In case there's, like, DLC or something. Yeah, in case there's, like, DLC that, um... Yep, so we can still just explore the world. We can't... We can't go back in here, though. What happens if you try? What happens if you try to? But it probably just, probably just empty. But, um. Okay, hold on. Just in case it does something stupid. Just in case. Because it's 500,000 souls. But, um. Yeah, like with the physic, there are so many different kinds. And there's so many different. That's okay. Yep. Uh, jokes on you guys. Uh, we're doing it again. We're 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 doing it again. Here we go. <laughs> Another twenty-three streams. More out the ring. Uh, guys, we're gonna start practicing my no hit run. Fuck that. <laughs> Fuck that. 
<laughs> I solemnly swear to never heal. I wonder. Where's a finger reader? What? Where's a finger reader? But, um... Who would you call it? Yeah, it, there were so many different things you could do with the physic. I wish you could have gotten a few more slots into it. Hey, so I killed your god. Okay, so she she doesn't she doesn't say. Eh, whatever. But um, Max is not gonna do a no hit run. <laughs> Fuck that. Heck no. It would be kind of fun though to try to do a speed run, start journey two, and we only do what's necessary. So really, we would just like sprint through everything. Yeah, we would sprint through everything, get the chaos ending. <laughs> Or not, not there. It's um here. Get the chaos ending. Sprint to the end. <laughs> Namkin. But um, where should we? Nah, I think there's only one spot that makes. Well, one of two. That makes sense on where to stop at. Oh, oops. I mean, am I wrong? You still got to go. Yeah, right, right. But, like, you know, just, like, as fast as possible, just take on every boss and just fucking run. But, um. Oh, that guy. Oh, that guy was taking on the tree sentinel. Oh, that's lovely. I guess I could have. They're good. Yep. I think this makes a nice, good, picturesque shot, don't you think? Just like that. Okay, so. So, thoughts on the game. Thoughts on the game. Uh, sorry, what was I saying? So, um... I really wish you could have upgraded the Wondrous Physic so you could use more stuff. Um, I understand. Okay, so the purpose of the spirit system was it really did feel like a lot of bosses expected you to have a party. And the spirits kind of created a little bit of a risk-reward and also like, Oh, I'm doing only melee. I don't need that spell casting shit. Get that mess out of here. And um, you would still have a reason to work on your mana as opposed to just weapon skills kind of a thing. So, you know, it helped create some diversity there. It was fun having all sorts of different spirits. They're definitely... Okay, I'm going to say something, and this is going to sound... This is going to sound a little mean, okay? Real quick, Joe, but as I'm talking, do those lights shining out mean anything? Do I need to go to specific places? But, um... There was definitely a part of me that felt like, I mean, with like the millennia fight, right? That was like, I don't want to use a spirit. It feels wrong. So I know a lot of, I'm sure there are people on the internet who are like, I'm sure there are people on the internet who are like, oh, if you use a spirit, you did it the easy way out, blah, blah, blah. And I don't want to say that, but there definitely was a part of me that just like, sometimes it didn't feel right. But by the same token with like Malekith, it was so nice just to say, fuck it. Let's go, and, you know, I doubt they mean anything. Okay, cool. You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't know if I would say it cheapens it, because it really did feel like a lot of bosses were designed to fight multiple enemies. And it didn't help, but, like, Malekith being a perfect example, even with the mimic, he killed it immediately and then turned to me like it was nothing. So, I would like to think the game is balanced to assume that you use spirits. Side note, I would love a mod of someone to give your character the ability to summon infinite spirits and then give you infinite mana, but make it so you can't fight in any other capacity. So you can only fight by summoning spirits. I think that'd be a lot of fun, but that's a side note. Just like, it, it, would, be a, it would be a mod. Obviously, it'd be broken. But just like going to every enemy and just being like, summon endless bullshit. <laughs> I think it'd be pretty funny. But, um, I don't know. Like, I get why it's there. Obviously, it's optional. You don't have to use it. 
but it definitely felt like some fights that I was like, no, this is wrong. It just needs to be me and Millennia. It just needs to be me and Radagon. It just needs to be me and Radan. So I get it. I think I like it overall. It just made me feel bad. Um, I already said about the weapon skill. I already said about the repetition. Um, as always in Dark Souls games or in, in FromSoft games, quests are hard. A lot of those quests I probably would have never figured out if I didn't Google them to know about them specifically. Like um, Millicent, you know, that spot that she ran off to and I wasn't aware of it. That kind of shit. Um, but the quests and the characters were fun. I really did like the characters. I just felt bad that almost all of them died. The only ones that lived was Nefeli. Well, Nefeli and Kenneth. Bach would have lived. That's it. Everyone else died. Now, I know it's like, well, Max, you killed Shabriri. Well, Max, you killed, you killed Vara, whatever his name is. Yeah, but they're all dead, and I feel bad. I, 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 I wish, I, I wish not everyone would die all the time. But, um, what else? The rune arc system was fun. I like how you could choose what, you know, it essentially is like burning humanity or burning embers. I really like that you could choose what it was. Um, I don't know, let's just go around the world. I like the idea of the temples and stuff, just like I said, or the cathedral, or the catacombs and the caves and stuff, but they just do get repetitive. I love that a lot of the stuff they want you to do really is, I'm pretty sure this whole southern continent was optional, because, like, what was hardcore required? Um, I think we're down. And even then, I'm not 100% sure. Getting to the capital. Even that, I'm not 100% sure either. Only for Rani quests. Oh, well, shit. There you go. Okay. That is something that I think is really interesting about this game. It's the same quality that Breath of the Wild has. Because, okay, if we're talking about solely what is necessary, what you have to do, right? Well, you probably need whatever the key is to get the lift to get in here. So whatever, whatever that takes, right? And then you just have to get to the fire thing, hit the fire thing, clear the boss here, go to the center, clear the boss there. Because you don't have to take out her. You don't have to take out him. I don't think you even need to get into here. So I bet speed runs of this game are nuts that way. Yeah, because all the... That is so weird that, like, how much of this is truly unnecessary and I find that fascinating um visually this was stunning I mean I know we all make fun of like poison swamps and um the scarlet roth swamp area was kind of painful but like how Kaled was mutated how this area was all nice and lush and green with forests and the big swamps the albinarics which I still don't know what their deal is I, I'm just gonna assume they're from Bloodborne um I would say Godric's Queen of Academy, the Capital Fire Giant, then Capital. Queen of Academy. The Queen of Academy is necessary? She's necessary to win? I don't remember. But, um... The mountainous here, the snow... God, this game was beautiful. The music was beautiful. Graphics were beautiful. I loved it. I okay. Uh, the item crafting. I think the item crafting was fine. It just it has the issue of look at all these different things we can make. If I remember to maybe maybe if I was like an archer more. Maybe if I like really worked on archery, I'd care a lot more about crafting. But as it stands, I didn't use ninety nine percent of this. Like I kind of use this as a bit, and that's it. I kind of use these. Until I got lightning bolt. And same with um, the fire pots. And all these boosts. And I didn't really care. Well I believe you need to open the capital up and visit the table. Oh. I'm not sure. I'm not sure to be honest. But um. Yeah I, I like the item crafting. It just it has the issue of what the fuck am I supposed to do with all this shit. 
Like seriously, there's so many different ways to do different things and use different items. And I love that. I'm sure there are tons of people out there who really get a lot of use out of it. I'm just not one of those people. Same with like the, the shackle and the mimic veil and the ancestral infant head and all these. And Okay, this is an opinion. I still think if your item has some kind of element on it, you should be able to add another element. You should be able to. I don't get why you can't, and I think that's dumb. I, sh I should be able to if I want to. Oh, Max, it's broken. Crank up the uh, difficulty on the enemies to account for it then. Fuck it. I would fight Redan because his rune is usable when Max, because Godrix does nothing with Max level. Well, that's fair, but I was more talking about, like, required. You know what I mean? Um, I love having all the souls. It just makes me happy. Um... I like the idea of the blue cipher ring. There's no covenants. That's something I'm kind of sad about. There's no specific covenants. I mean, VAR kind of has one, but that's more just encouraging you to go kill people. Um, the blue, this kind of makes you like a sentinel, blue sentinel, but not really. I like that you don't get invaded by real people unless you're playing with a friend. I think that's nice. But, um... Yeah, look at all this. Look at all this shit. Look at all these berries. Look at all of them. Jeez. This shit was supposed to be rare. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's another thing. All of these items, yeah, exceedingly rare to find. 39, and I haven't used a single one. Same with the, uh, what was it, the gravel stone? Like, super rare. <laughs> super rare. 36. I have more, I got more golden set. Actually, I have just as much, nah, never mind, that's wrong. But still, like, 36 gravel stones, 16 string. Guess which I got more of. But, um, the smithing stone system was fine. I don't like that they capped you at a certain number of golden seeds. I think whatever formula that made it so you can get more flasks should have kept going. Um, these, between the ghost and the grave, really doesn't seem that even. You know what I mean? All there definitely is a hierarchy of spirits and stuff. I like the cracks of the ritual pot system. I think the system of it was very good overall. Like it encouraged you to use those items and to know you could rebuild them. I think that was done very well. Um I don't know why I have a lot of these items. I really don't but it's cool. I got so much celestial. Um, I like how they did the crafting system because it gave you things to buy and rewards and like the maps and the treasure chests and stuff I think was great. The spell variety. See, my first instinct is to say that um, it's uneven, but a lot of these spells like, okay, so there's more incantations and sorcery, but a lot of these sorceries require faith and I like how they bleed over a lot. You know what I mean? That, like... Okay, for example... Um, I don't know if you ever plan on using these, but... This takes intelligence... And faith. Um, the... Which one? Yeah, these ones. These ones. They take intelligence and faith. And then the dragon ones. All the dragon ones are so cool. God, I wanna... I wanna play my arcane build and just really focus on leveling up arcane. And, like, really focus on doing the dragon spells. I think that'd be a lot of fun. But, um... And then on the strength build, like, just use the beast shit. I can't believe the stone is a spell. It's so good. That's the sad thing. It's good. The flame monk shit and fire and lightning are always the best. The weapon skills, like, a lot of these are really fun, and I really like how they, um... I really like how they encourage so many different styles of play. And it's nice that there's, like, varieties of, like, here's the blood version of the stab. Here's the blood version of the of the thump. Here's the, you know, here's the ice version. So I really appreciate that. Once again, though, there's definitely a hierarchy. Oh, uh, what does this do? Ooh. God, maybe I should. That should be another game I do. Do an archery build. But, um... 
Yeah, because you can't slot multiple skills, it does feel kind of limiting. Like, you have to choose one. You have to. And if you want a shield, you gotta put... You have to put no skill on a shield. Yeah, like, you have to put no... You have to put no skill on the shield and then slap it with this. But, um... Oh. That's oh, all good. It's all good. And, uh, yeah, we'll be doing Resident Evil 8 on Monday. We're about done. I'm just finishing up my thoughts. These are just my rants. But, yeah, thanks so much for coming, man. It was really good to have you. But, um... What was I saying? Damn, you made me lose some shit. Yeah, I'm fine. Um... Yeah, it really just does come down to you are forced to use one. Now, I get it. At the end of the day... You have all these cool weapons, and you have to use one. But, ah, oh, there's just so many that I want to try that it makes me want to play another game, except it has the problem that I always have with these kinds of games of, like, well, Max, do a new game plus, and you could just start with all the cool equipment. But I don't want to. I like that struggle at low levels. You know what I mean? I don't want to just respec and... I mean, I could. I could just endlessly respec and play with different builds, but I don't want to. I, I like starting from the beginning. I like starting with nothing and then, like, working your way up again, which I know would mean, like, remaking Cranial Vessel. What the fuck? With which the monks... Barracks severed his own head as lust of the others, intending it be used as a candle stand. His faith yet smolders from within the... What the fuck? It's weird. But yeah, there's so many different weird weapons and things. And are you ever really going to use all of them? And yeah, of course, the unique ones have things that you can't switch out. But they're unique, so I'm willing to justify it. At least a little. But, um... Yeah, it makes me want to play this game again. Because of all these really cool different builds. All these really cool different things you can do. I never, I used the bow like once or twice. I kind of, kind of wish I did that more. Maybe I should really just do one where all I do is just like, the goal is only use a bow or only use crossbows. Could be fun. Same with the shields. I feel the same way about that. Same with the armor. There's so much cool different armor. I love that we discovered veteran is the best, but it's too hideous. So I refuse. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. Um charms too i like the system that you get more charm slots and there's such a god this game is just so good this overall i absolutely adored this game would i rank it my favorite from soft game ask me tomorrow but i'm likely gonna say yes if not top three this game was an absolute freaking delight and i loved it and um i've seen i've seen iron hearts i've seen it or, oh, sorry, Atomic Hearts. I watched Atomic Hearts, and um, it gave me some major Bioshock and Prey vibes and System Shock, which is really all... Well, all those are based on System Shock, but still. And it looks really cool. So I might have to check it out when it comes out. What it said, November... It said uh, 2022, and then something bursts, so either November, October, or December. But um, it looks really cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'd, I'd, be, I'd be down to play it. I love Bioshock. But, um, yeah, and I, I just want to take time to say thank you all so much for watching. I really had a lot of fun with this. I recognize this is going to be stream like 23, and we're still going to do one more. But, um, this was so much fun. I really, really enjoyed playing it. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, 100% interests me. I'm not good at keeping up with new releases, but, um, I, I'd be down to playing on stream. Day's gone. I feel like I heard that. Okay, so you want to ask about what the next game series we're playing on? Uh, here is the here is the plan. So on Monday we're gonna be okay. I can do that. On Monday we're gonna be restarting Resident Evil Eight because simply put, you guys are saying that I wasn't suffering enough and that I was shitting on the game. So we need to raise the difficulty back up so I actually suffer a little bit. Nice dual spears. But um. Well, let me finish my rant. Jeez. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that will be on Monday. On Wednesday, 
uh, on Wednesday, we are going to be doing one more Elden Ring stream. However, this time, we're not going to be actually playing the game. We're going to be doing an ultimate tier list. We're not going to rate. We're not going to rank the games because I, I don't like doing that. Instead, we're going to rank every boss that we fought from Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Bloodborne, Sekiro, Elden Ring, and Demon Souls is included in there, even though we haven't done Demon Souls. Um, by the same... Who'd you call it? By the same notion, phrase. We're also going to be doing the uh, all the enemies and then all the NPCs. I think it'll be a lot of fun. So, um, yeah, there'll be one more Elden Ring stream. And then after so after Resident Evil, we're going to be taking a small break from franchise. We're going to be playing Metal Gear Rising Vengeance and the Halo Infinite campaign. But after that Elden Ring stream, it's kind of up in the air a little bit. I'm just going to call it viewer's choice. So... <sighs> Let's start that on Friday. So between now and Friday, whether it is on stream or on the Discord, I posted a thing that it's not an official poll, but just in general what people would be interested in seeing. Uh, we need to make a choice between one of four games. Either... He goes back and forth. He goes back and forth with that, not going to lie. But... um. Sometimes he he wants to hang out with Megan more, and sometimes he's like, "Oh my goodness, Max, hi, I love you." Yeah, okay. So we're gonna be choosing between one of four games, okay? Outlast one, Dead Space one, Dying Light, and Evil Within. The current vote is Dying Light, but I still want to leave it up to you guys. We're gonna choose one of those four, and that will be the viewers. Sure. That will be the viewers' choice. We'll then be moving it so that the franchise is every Monday and Wednesday. And the side series is every Friday. Because we do longer streams on Fridays, kind of like today. So, um, yeah. Then after that, the next two or three games, depending on how long each one takes, will be viewer choice. It'll be the same kind of thing. It'll be, um, you guys tell me about it. We kind of do a general, like, hands-up, hands-down vote. And um, it's discussed in the Discord. We'll play other ones then. Have you played any of the four games? I played Dead Space 1 before, but it was a long time ago. It was, um, I've seen some gameplay Evil Within. I've seen some gameplay Evil Within. I played Dead Space 1 once, and it was all in one night when I was on leave in the military. So that was probably 2015, 2016. It's been a long time. So don't expect me to know it perfectly. I'll know the basics, though. But, um, yeah, it'll be one of those four. The current vote is Evil Within. So please, I'd say comment in the description, but in chat, on the Discord, somewhere, tell me. We'll do a general vote. That'll be the next few. And um, you kind of want me to struggle with Outlast? Well, start a vote. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I think that's it. It's great and terrifying because you can barely fight back. See, that's the shit I hate. I like being able to fight back. It's why I think I clicked so much with Silent Hill and Resident Evil. Because you as opposed to like Amnesia Dark Descent, because you can fight back. It might not it might be fruitless. There might be too many of them to do that, but you can. Nope, sure, I'll keep that in mind. But um Yeah, that's the general plan. Resident Evil 8 on Monday, Elden Ring tier list on Wednesday, and the the beginning of viewer choice will be on Friday. I think I got everything, yeah. Jeez. Noted. If and when if and when we do outlast. Noted cat. You'll definitely be an invaluable resource there, because uh, I read all of them, they're great. Good to know. But um Yeah, Resident Evil 8, then RE Resistance, then Mel Gear Rising Revenge, this is Halo Infinite, and then we'll do the Metro Kinnick the franchise. Yeah. <sighs> Probably during the tier list, I'll um, think of more things I love and hate about Elden Ring. But I overall, I absolutely adored this game. It was too much fun. And I even during the bits, I got real mad. I absolutely loved it. So, that being said. Perfect. Let's end the episode off here, shall we? Oh, uh, I read them all. I will tell you the backstory so you know why you're at the beginning of the game and after the game's LP is over, make sure you have all of them. Sure. 
Yeah, if if we do Outlast, I'm cool with that. As long as it's not, you know, spoiling while we're doing it. But um Yeah. I'm sad to see it go. Alright. Let's end the episode off here though, cause um because something might be coming up for me to do, so it's not it's not it's a problem. That's all good. Yeah, thanks so much for being here. And, um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching and joining me on this adventure. I know it was long, but I, I hope you had fun. I had a really, really good time with it. So, if anything, this is spoiling me. Um, yeah. But, um, yeah, Cat Jail. I don't know if Border Renders are probably here. But all of you and everyone lurking, thank you so much for watching. I, I it was, oh, like, it, it was a lot of fun. But. Yeah, let's end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all had fun. I know I did. And I will see you then because I'm an awkward fuck. I will see you then. There you go. Thanks for coming. Bye.